that and more on this stream tonight. So, uh, yeah, should we get into it, ladies and gentlemen? Let's get into it. We can have a Psycho Pokemon raid at Rave anytime we want. Right now, we got Pokemon to play. Let's do it. Uh, what should we play today, then, eh? Should we play some Super Nintendo? No, let's play Pokemon Sword. Let's do it, boys. Let's do it. I'm not going to be able to play this game for a week. I have committed to streaming it, so I probably won't play it. Um, which means, if I do play it, I'll probably, like, wander around the wild area, or maybe, like, try and battle with my unevolved Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, yeah, yeah, I'm committed to streaming it all, so uh, let's see how that goes, eh? Tomorrow's Undertale, by the way, so uh, look forward to that. I know I am looking so forward to Undertale. It's going to be so good. Oh, and there I am. Have you missed me, guys? Have you missed me? There's our lovely boy. There's our lovely boy, Dan. Woo, Undertale? Yeah, you bet your ass, Woo, Undertale. Woo! All right, um, cool, cool. I need my Temi emote. Yeah. Well, you're not going to get one on Discord. It's not on Discord, on Twitch. But, uh, yeah, certainly spam the one in Discord. Oh, all right, okay. Um, what are we doing today? Welcome back to uh, um, Pokemon that Sword, ladies and gentlemen. Hopefully you've all had a lovely day. I want to train Yampas, man. I want my Yampas to be uh, to be better, actually. I wonder. I wonder. Let's uh, let's switch it out a wee bit. Let's get Yampas there, um, and we're gonna give Yampas the Silk Scarf, I think. So remember, we picked up a Silk Scarf, which will raise the. Um, what does this do? Candidate is packed with energy. When consumed, it will raise the Dynamax level of a single Pokemon by one. A high level means high HP when Dynamax. Okay. So yeah, the Silt Scarf will raise the power of normal type moves. I really like Silt Scarf. I think Silt Scarf is pretty cool. Uh, okay. I think there's a Pokemon Center. I think there's a Pokemon Center just to the right. Scamper that Yamper. Yeah, you're going to be scampering around today, are you, Yamps? Yamper's going to be wrecking face. Hopefully we'll see some water type Pokemon. Then we can use Nuzzle a ton. At the very least. Welcome back, H7. Welcome back. Hopefully everything is well. Hopefully you have your, your tea now and all that good stuff. We're just healing up, healing up before we uh, before we head off. We, of course, have our... Um, I'd call it a dream team. It's uh, very early in its development. Uh, we are maining right now at Yampa and the evolved form of our starter, Score Bunny, a.k.a. a Raboot. Uh, the Ninja Bunny Boy looks very cool indeed. Uh, the rest I'm not sold on yet, but I'm leveling them up anyway just to see some evolutions. Of course, our Blip Bug from the early game has since evolved into Dotler, um, a psychic and bug type, which I think is very, very cool. So, yeah, lots of uh, information gained yesterday, which is amazing. Uh, right, let's, uh, let's friggin' do it, shall we? Let's friggin' do it. Let's start off with a Pokemon battle. You saw the opening ceremony, right? Then you know why I'm excited and want to battle. <sighs> so dreamy. I forgot I also helped my dad clean the house too. Damn, dude, you've been busy today. I get tired so easily, but I can never uh, fall asleep at night. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, dude. It's no good when you can't sleep at night, right? No good at all. Makes me feel bad when I can't sleep at night. Uh, all right, first of all, let's nuzzle. Let's friggin' nuzzle this bad boy. We were in the opening thing? Yeah, we are. Woo! All these blonde schoolgirls. Yeah, they just like cute Pokemon, apparently. They all like the cute Pokemon, they do. All right, let's friggin' tackle this uh, this one for a wee while. All right, so uh, even though paralyzed, um, even though it's paralyzed, Vulpix will uh, keep taking the first turn if it keeps using Quick Attack. Whenever it doesn't use Quick Attack, though, Yampers will get the first hit, which is awesome. And thankfully, Yampers is a tanky son of a gun. Not the strongest yet, but a very tanky Pokemon. Good defenses on both sides uh, early on, so uh, we can take these hits all day. Um, but yeah, this will be a nice little warm-up for our wee boy. And hopefully we'll be able to catch a bunch of Pokemon today as well. I want to catch a lot of Pokemon today. Try to. Um, yeah, so let's do it. And Hunter's Nova has come out of nowhere. 
with an absolute banger of a raid. Hunter's Nova with that 10 person raid, which hasn't popped up on screen because I still haven't bloody got a friggin' notification. Um, but hey, Nova, Hunter's Nova, how you doing? A wild cast appears. Quick, throw Liddy Colo emotes at her. <laughs> Oh, and Captain as well. Taha. We we're raiding into a Pokemon spoilers. Yeah, you are. Hopefully, uh. I mean, you can leave if you want. It's okay. <laughs> I lost, but I'm still excited. You don't look it, love. You don't look it. How you doing, Nova? What have you been playing? Um. Planet Zoo, I imagine, right? Planet Zoo? You've been playing that? It looked like you were playing that zoo game. Did you have a good stream? Oh, God. The Nova looks. Thank you for following. Please enjoy that Pikachu on screen. It's just for you. It's just for you. There you go. Thank you for that. I appreciate it. Holy crap. You guys are raiding hard. I shall stop the raid spam. That's perfectly fine. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I, I like the spam. The spam is good. Uh, but yeah, hopefully you're well. Oh, and much prey. Nice. Planet Zero, we're finishing. Oh, you're finishing the Kuni 2 today. Oh, so good. Very good, very good. Hopefully you had a lot of fun with it. Uh, Nova Army has arrived. Yeah. I leave you with my favorite babies. Aww. I will I will look after them. No, I'll probably steal their souls and uh, and, and, and their sanity. Uh, when they come back to your stream, there will be uh, there will be empty husks because I will take all of their goodness. I will steal the joy and the laughter. <laughs> But I've, apart from that, yeah, uh, yeah. Hopefully, uh, hopefully you had a great stream. <laughs> DJ, that's a secret. Oh, forget I said that. Oh, I know, I'm sorry. If you left to steal, oh, there's always a little bit left. It's like when you're, um, you know, trying to drink a can of coke, and there's always a little bit left at the bottom. There's always a little bit of sanity to be found. I'll tell you that for nothing. Tell you that for nothing, ladies and gentlemen. Me forever. Oh, such a sleepy hate seven. <laughs> Wait, there is a donkey Pokemon? Yes, yeah, so this is Mudbray. Mudbray was a Generation s ooh, 7 Pokemon, I believe. I think it was a Sun and Moon Pokemon, um, which is very, very cool. Evolves into a mighty horse. DJ, I want that. All right, let's go. Uh, wait, is this a battle? I can't actually remember if we're battling or if this is uh, catchable. I'll try and catch it if I can. You want it? All right, we'll get it. Let's freaking get it. If you want it, we'll get it. Here we go. You ready for this? Ready for this? All right, we're going to catch a mud bray. There we go. He's been here since on the moon. It's wild. Yeah, okay. Good, good, good. I can't remember. No other with the, with the big old um, um, raid there. Amazing. Have a good stream. I'm going to play League game before bed. Ah, good luck with your League game, Nova. Have a good night. And thanks for raiding. And I'll see you next time. Oh, thank you for the hundred corgis. Uh, corgis, I appreciate that. Big hooks KMS, thank you. <laughs> appreciate it, thank you. I actually got to go myself. So I actually wanted to check this out. That's all right, Taha, don't worry about it. No obligation to stay, my good friend. Have a good night. Thanks for raiding, and I'll see you next time. Farewell. Farewell, my good friend. But yes, say hello to Mudbray. Don the Mudbray, the donkey Pokemon. Loads weighing up to 50 times as much as its own body weight pose no issues for this Pokemon. It's skilled at making use of mud. So there you go, a ground type donkey Pokemon. Very, very cool indeed. He's so cute. I know, right? Isn't he a good boy? He's a good boy, our Mudbray. We like Mudbray. He evolves into such a majestic looking beast as well. So uh, yeah, hopefully we'll see that one day. Oh, hello. What does this mean? Oh, okay, there you go. Okay, so apparently whenever I uh, catch a Pokemon, it shouts to the world that I've caught a Pokemon. Very cool. There you go. All right. I love him. Oh, well, he's all yours. <laughs> he's so cute. <laughs> okay. You're not online now? Oh, I'm not online, am I? Oh. I? Oh, yes, I need to be set to online. Okay. Just local then, I guess. Don't let him steal your donkey boy. No, we'll be safe. We'll be safe. I've been studying foreign languages, computers, and Pokemon. Good for you, you nerd. Well, now I can be paranoid about being seen online. No, it's all right. Don't worry. You're all right. Don't worry, this this little Hannah girl's not going to steal your Pokemon, it's okay. But we have a lovely little Pancham here. We do need to worry about fighting type moves with Pancham, so we are going to switch out to Reboot. Yampa being an electric and normal type Pokemon, he is weak to fighting type moves, so we'll bring in Reboot instead. Connect online, you'd also see my stuff. <gasps> Should we do it? Let's connect online after this. There you go, that would have done some... Oh! 
Oh no. Oh, you brought Yampers back out. God damn it. All right. Uh, all right. Let's see if we can tank it then. We'll, we'll try and paralyze him a little bit. There we go. The junior blonde school girl. Yeah, the the they're, they're all blonde here. <laughs> Everyone's blonde. All right, you're using circle throw, are you? All right, so this is going to be annoying. So circle throw will keep uh, tossing out our active Pokemon and replacing with replacing it with a brand new Pokemon. So we're going to be playing this friggin' ring around the rosy here, where we just have to kind of smack him with whatever Pokemon we have, which is fine, I suppose. Sexy Boots Nickit. Yeah, good old Nickit. Good old Nickit. Uh, I actually don't remember what Snarl does. What does Snarl do? The user yells as if it's ranting about something which loads special attack the opposing uh, Pokemon. Right, okay. All right, fair enough. Um, are you lagging? I'm sorry that you're lagging, my good friend. I'm sorry that you're lagging. Dude, you're going to have to start to get ready for bed, but have a great Poke stream, my friend. No worries, Captain. Thanks for dropping by, bud. Have a wonderful night, and I'll see you next time. Farewell, my good friend. Farewell. Nova's lot are a lovely lot, so uh, yeah, we uh, we like Nova. We like Nova, and we like uh, we like all of our wonderful fans, because uh, all of our wonderful viewers, because uh, they're all lovely. Every single last one of them. Every single last one of them. They're all bloody wonderful. They are. All right. Okay, now that Reboot is actually in the driving seat here, we can use Double Kick and smack this Panjam back to the friggin' wild area. Well, I say that. Holy crap. It's actually really tanky. It's very tanky. Oh no, please. Damn it, this Panjam is ravaging us right now. God damn it. Nick it back into the action. <laughs> uh, come on, Nick it. You got this. Except me at the moment, I'm both salty and tired, and we all know the death horn that comes with that. Oh, you'll be alright, lads. You'll be alright. Don't worry, fella. Just relax, and uh, you'll have a good night. We should get a panda, too? Yeah, we, we can get one of those from the wild area. Uh, we didn't explore the wild area too much yesterday. Oh, Nick, it just survives. We didn't explore the wild area too much yesterday, so... Uh, yeah, there we go. We'll uh, we'll see what happens. We might be able to go back there. I'm going to assault every trainer you see. Go for it, dude. They deserve it. They're all going to get crushed by me. <laughs> what a horrendous fight that was. What? I lost. My Pokemon savvy wasn't enough. You just spam the same move over and over again, you bugger. Get, get out of here, kid. Get out of here. Ooh. Oh, Gossy Flare. Okay. Um, all right. Uh, how do I do this? I want to do this. Uh, how do I go online? I don't know how I go online. Uh, do I just like to do like? Wait, maybe I can do it from this venue. Learn to Pokemon, kid. Yeah, exactly. Uh, will this do it? Who wants a Magikarp? Someone take my Magikarp. Uh, there you go. Okay, good. Y and then press plus. Ah, okay. All right, that's probably an easier way than doing it here. Uh, all right. Uh. Ah, clever. Wait, that's a map. Uh, I can toggle weather on and off. Oh, okay. Just that's from the map. Sorry, X. Okay. <laughs> uh, Y and then X. Uh, all right, wait. Okay, no, I think I did it. I think I did it. Did I do it? No, I was right. Why and then? Oh, right, there we go. <laughs> we did it either way. <laughs> we did it. We did it, guys. We did it. Uh, all right, there we go. So we've now got people who are kind of playing online now. Um... Very cool. All right. I don't think I'll see too many spoilers here. But look at all these nerds who really, really want, like, rare Pokemon. Very cool. Grats, I did it. Yeah. <laughs> all right. I need to heal up. I can't be bothered going back to the Pokemon Center. So we'll heal up Yampa. And we'll heal up Reboot. King, King the Eevee. Oh. Oh, hopefully we find an Eevee in this game. I think that'd be really cool if we did. 
Uh, the Switch 3DS button's uh, opposite to Xbox, which is what got us going all confused. Ah, fair enough. Fair enough. We got it, though. Don't you worry, lad. Don't you worry. It's a lucky D. Good old lucky D. Lucky me for a lucky D. All right, let's nuzzle this bad boy. So, yeah, we're trying to level up our good friend Yampers here today. I think that's going to be the goal today. Um... We'll we'll level up rookie. Uh, we'll level up Yampers, and then we'll have Score Bunny and Yampers in a good place. What a cute, cute king he would be, King Eevee. I mean, you can get a crown on Pokemon Let's Go Eevee, but it will cost you uh, the small sum of a freaking million Poke Dollars. So, uh, yeah, <laughs> it's a, it's a lot of money. <laughs> level that good boy. This good boy's getting so leveled. Don't you worry about that. Don't you worry about that. Hoping to see some evolutions today as well, actually. Uh, hoping, like, Tootle or Scrovat or Nickit get an evolution. I don't know if they even do. Like, they might not do, but... Uh... Oh, trade completed? Did someone... Oh! Someone traded my Magikarp! Oh my god, it's all happening. Someone traded for my Magikarp. There we go. We got a Tootle. There you go. <laughs> that was weird. There you go. We got ourselves a Tootle. Alright. There you go. So that's how the surprise trade works. You put it... You put the surprise trade um, out there. And then if someone wants to go for it, they will. Very cool. Uh, got some Gossy Flares. But let's take a look at this fella, shall we? Oh, instead of a Pokemon, I found a trainer. I'll have to check how strong you are. Uh, what oh. So I'm between age 5 and 55 traded you. Yeah. Yeah, there's, uh... How <laughs> old do you reckon they were? Have a guess. <laughs> quite the distance there, isn't it? Quite, quite the difference, sorry. Alright, we got a lovely Budgie here. A lovely Budgie. Uh, Budgie, just a grass-type Pokemon. It will do this annoying absorb thing, but it won't be too strong because Yamp has got a big old thick hind, and that absorb won't penetrate it too much. Uh, this game has a wide appeal. Oh, absolutely. Like, you know, friggin' 30-year-old me. And yet there'll be, like, seven-year-olds playing this right now. So it's like My Little Pony. My Little Pony. Yes, this is basically my My Little Pony. <laughs> my Little Yamper. My Little Yamper. Oh, I love it. I love it. Come on, Yamper. Get this job done, fella. Oh, beautiful. Big fan of that. All people will get this for Xmas, and I will crush them all. <laughs> I can't wait to start destroying noobs in Pokemon battles. That's going to be great. When Christmas comes around and all the, uh, all the little kids who don't know anything about Pokemon, they start battling, and I'm just going to friggin' get wrecked by every single last one of them, because kids are probably going to be way better than me at this game than I am. Oh, God. Oh, Gossifly. Okay, here we go. Crush their dreams. Dream Crusher DJ, that's what they call me. <laughs> uh, Alright, Gossiflare, let's see what you've got, eh? Oh, it's like we've just started the game, we're just using Tackle. And here we go, Rapid Spin with the Speed Boost there. God, that's amazing, I love that so much. There's going to be some really good application for that, I, I bet. I bet some Pokemon who are Rapid Spin... Well, saying that, in, Rapid Spin might not actually be too useful in this game for getting rid of entry hazards. I've not seen an entry hazard yet, but at the very least it'll give you a speed boost, so that's cool. Alright, let's keep tackling. Hopefully you guys have had a wonderful day. Feel free to let me know uh, what you've been up to today, ladies and gentlemen. I'll tell you what I've been up to today. Uh, not much, actually. Not much. I've had a very nice, calm, relaxing day. I needed it. I've had a bit of a had a bit of a tough week, but uh, it's been fine. It's been fine. Been very excited to play more Pokemon. Had a good day. Been knitting all day long. Oh, so good, so good. You create such magical things with your knitting. So God love you. God love you. And SP three two two four. My favorite SP in the world. Thank you, lady. Thank you. Thank you, my lovely, lovely friend. You. Thank you for resubscribing. Third month. 
I love it. I love it. How you doing, SP? Hopefully you're well, my good friend. Hopefully you are bloody well. Thank you for subbing. You are fabulous. You're awesome. You're awesome, man. Oh, and big hooks from KMS. Big hooks for you. Thank you, thank you. Doing all right, yeah? Good, good. Glad you're having a good day, man. Oh, and your badge upgraded as well, so that's really cool. Thank you, my good friend. Glad you're having a... Glad you're having a good day. Hopefully you're ready for some Pokemon and some silly voices like this one. Youch, your Pokemon are way too strong. <laughs> there we go. Oh, and SP, you're English, right? This game's totally English. It's like, it's got such an English feel to it. It's awesome. So uh, yeah, expect all the Englishness. <laughs> we got new emotes too? Yeah, we did. Yeah, you'll be able to use those if you wish, my good friend. Uh, all right, let's uh, let's tackle this bad boy. We need to get some stronger moves for Gossy Flare, actually. It's a big day. Yeah, friggin' big day indeed. Ah. All right, you know what? Stop hurting my stop hurting my corgi. <laughs> but SP, we got a corgi Pokemon finally, and it feels good, man. We got it, we got ourselves a lovely corgi. So happy. Appreciate that, Pokemon. Thanks for giving me my Corgi in my English Pokemon game. Right, uh, let's see. Oh, it's Sonya. Hey, Jim Challenger. You looked real ace out there during the opening ceremony. Thanks. Appreciate it. You always look ace. Oh, but where's Hop? Where is Hop? I honestly thought that said he's dead. I, I saw a head and I thought, dead? He's not dead. Uh, he went on ahead. He can't still. He can't sit still at all, can he? Guess he really wants to catch up to his brother. Sonia, who is a disappointment to a terrible grandmother. I know, right? Oh, it's a common thing in England. <laughs> oh, I know. Let me tell you about something a bit interesting. Oh, okay, go for it. You see that building over there? It's a company owned by Chairman Rose. Oh, no. Oh no, I know what the main story is. They're tearing up the countryside and they're polluting the air. That's it. That's proper English, isn't it? Just past Route 3, there's a mine where they dig up ore. That building over there processes it into energy. Oh no. In other words, the chairman is responsible for, pro for providing the Galar region with its energy too. They paved paradise and put in the parking lot. I feel like I know that from somewhere. Is that a song lyric? But absolutely! <sighs> Can't say I... It's a song! Okay, good. Okay. Oh, gosh. <laughs> I was on the edge for that one. Can't say I really get him, but the chairman seems like a pretty, a, a pretty brilliant guy, right? That's what they want you to think, Sonya. Here's a little something for having a chin wag with me. It's an escape rope. Good job, DJ. Thanks! I love a good chin wag, mate. Oh, there we go. Uh, so, escape rope will allow us to escape caves or dungeons. I like how they use the word dungeon. Very good. I'll heal up your Pokemon too. Oh, thank you. Appreciate that. The way to Turf Field is pretty long, but that's a kind of challenge in its own right. Good luck, Jim Challenger. Cheers, Sonya. Fabulous, she is. Fabulous. Good old Sonya. All right, we continue. What's everyone been up to, eh? I love this. I like this. Uh... I like spying on people. It's like Twitter. It's like Pokemon Twitter. Uh, all right, what have we got here? Oh, you're new. We have new things, ladies and gentlemen. It's Roly Coley. <laughs> DJ such a boy. <laughs> That's me, man. That's me. Um. Oh God. Okay. Uh. I mean, you look like a rock type. Oh my God, I love you. Like a bit of Roly Coley. It's got a little wheel. It's got a little wheel. I like that. It's got a little wheel underneath him. He's like a friggin' motorbike rock thing. What even is that? It, it's, it's a rock with a little wheel. <laughs> That's what we all drive. Oh, uh, oh! You just lifted up my yampers and squished him. How dare you? All right, we're going to be uh, catching this bad boy. Uh, there we go. Oh, what? Yeah. Smackdown. He uh, he lifted us up and then smushed us on the ground. What a bad boy. <laughs> Look at him. He looks like... He looks a bit... Sorry, he looks like a bit of Smoky Quarks. Ooh. 
It looks very cool at the very least, yeah. You flattened our good boy? Yeah, but don't worry, we always spring back. We always spring back. You don't mess with the Ampers. Anyone see that movie where the demon Tyre kills people? It reminds me of that. Demon Tyre? No, I might have seen one about a demon car before. I never demon Tyre, though. That's cool, though. What was it called? Do you remember? I'd like to hear more. <laughs> Roly Coley, the Cole Pokemon. Most of its body has the same composition as coal. Fittingly, this Pokemon was first discovered in coal mines about 400 years ago. So, uh, yeah, England's got a pretty um, pretty big history with uh, coal mining and all that. So, uh, yeah, that's really cool. That's really cool. Uh, Alright, okay, that's enough of that. Alright, fella. Hey, what the hell? I'll show you what I carry. Letters and victory. Ah, oh. <laughs> there you go. Uh, I think it's called Rubber or something. Going back a few years. A demon tire. That's so funny. I like that. That's hilarious. <laughs> All right. It is so cool that a postman has a deli bird, of course. Thankfully, deli bird is a flying type. We've got a present here, though, and it's healing. Thank you for healing me, I appreciate that. Present can either be healing or it can be a bomb, so uh, yeah, let's hope for healing all the time. There you go. Oh, I heard of that movie, but I think of it, is that a gift of a tire falling down a hill and an army guy kicks it and falls over? Oh, no, I've never heard of it. That's so cool. Coasty battle, yeah. Get wrecked, fake beard, yeah. Yeah, you ain't got a good beard. I know, man, it's a pretty good beard. <laughs> All right, I'm hoping I can survive one more. Uh... Oh, and we got we got the we got the hit. There we go. Free hit KO. Very good. We really need a better electric move. Nuzzle's very very weak. The only reason why it's doing us so well is because a well it it, it paralyzes, which is good. But secondly, ah, roar's not good. It paralyzes, but it's also getting stabbed, so it's getting stronger because we are an electric type. Uh, Roar is not useful for us. All it does is it sends wild Pokemon away from battle so we can escape a little easier. Uh, it also switches uh, Pokemon in battle, like actual battles as well. Uh, Raboot's got to level up. Uh, Dotler got to level up. Scrobert got to level up. Nickit got to level up. But Nuzzle is adorbs. It's the most adorbs move, isn't it? <laughs> Turns out I was counting your victory. Oh, what, what? Oh, tally ho. Chocks away! Oh, I'm a good one. All right, will do, lad. Will do. Thanks for thanks for help, lad. Oh, someone set up camp here. Cool. If you want to heal up your Pokemon, there's nothing like setting up your camp and cooking them a good meal. Here, you can add this berry to the pot. Oh, we got yourself a cherry berry. Very good. We should try some camping. If you ever come across a tent, check it out to join the camp or whoever set it up. If you'd like, you're welcome to visit my camp too. It's the one right here. All right. You found Becca's Pokemon camp. Would you like to pay them a visit? Bet your ass I do. We can be like Ash and the team in the anime. Yeah. <gasps> Wait, do I get to control them? Uh. Okay. Uh. Oh. Wait, no, I don't get to control them. Oh, I was so excited. <laughs> oh, oh, look what we got here. We need Brock, yeah, to cook us some food, man. Blo bloody hell, you're right. This is actually too British. I know, it's amazing, isn't it? Ah, oh. Wooloo. Wooloo. Hey, Wooloo. How you doing? Oh, look at Wooloo go. Ah, oh, gorgeous Wooloo. The waggle butts eye. Where where my where my yampers at? Oh, there's two of them. There's two yampers. Oh, the full picks. Oh, love it. All right. Okay, that's cool. I like that. Is this Nintendo Dogs? Yes, it is exactly Nintendo. <laughs> All right. Nothing behind the tents. Okay. Um, I feel like there was something down here. I'd love a Nintendo Dogs game that was actually Pokemon. I think that'd be dope. Was there something down here? There is. Ah, more little girls to beat up. Yeah, I mean, beat up Pokemon. Yay! Why are you thinking of passing through without even looking at my Pokemon? Yes, actually. Yes. For the record, I don't beat up little girls. I destroy them in Pokemon now. All right, so Kaylee has a purloin. Just a nice 
kind of normal dark type Pokemon, we can beat a Purloin. Dogs beat cats, am I right, guys? Here we go. Go get him, Corgi boy. Oh, he's so tanky. He's such a tanky lad. I love it. You are correct, sir. Yeah. I mean, I love cats, but Corgis, man. Corgis OP. <laughs> cats are adorable, but Corgis are amazing, too. There we go. All right. Look how tanky we are. Like, we're not being hit by, like, super strong moves. I'll, I'll, I'll say that. But at the same time, like, we got health for days here. He's a big boy. Uh, my daughter's cat is the best cat, but dog's real. Oh, good old, good old Morty. Yeah, lovely Morty. <laughs> All right, there you go. A bit of experience from that. What else you got for me? We got a Scrovert. OSP, you'll love this. Definitely a dog person. Oh, good, good, good. Good lad. SP, look how, look how fat Scrovert's cheeks are. That squirrel's cheeks are massive and I love it. <laughs> it's so Disney. Oh, so Disney. It's it's like something Snow White would uh, see in the forest, right? I love it. All right. I know, right? Isn't it adorable? That was one of the first Pokemon we saw, SP. Chippendale. Yeah, Chippendale. Yeah, absolutely. No, you're so right. I love it so much. Yeah, isn't it adorable? We have one on our team. We're hoping to... Oh, my God. Okay. We're hoping to see it evolve. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> Yampers don't die. <laughs> Yampers don't die, plus. That was one HP. Alright, let's go, Reboot. We also have a Ninja Bunny. Save the Yamper, don't worry, he's been saved. He has been saved. And now Ninja Bunny Reboot is about to stick the Reboot right in Scrovet's face. There you go. No double kick animation. I thought there'd be a, a kick animation. That, that's a feels bad, man, but that's all right. That's all right. All right, beautiful, beautiful. Win or lose, I don't mind. I just wanted to show off my Pokemon. Well, go for you, love, go for you. Go for you, love, go for you, go for you. Uh, right, okay. Um, gonna heal a wee bit because Yampers is in a spot of bother. Uh, all right, we'll do one more. We'll do. We're burning through potions, but that's fine. That's that's exactly what a loser would say. Yeah. No. 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 That's loser talk, little girl. Oh, very good. Very good. I'm glad we're all on the same page there. Very good. All right, let's shake this tree. Let's shake this tree, man. There we go. All right. Okay, beautiful. I will take all that. Thank you very much. So we got Raspberry, Person, Petcha, all very useful. There we go. Right, let's continue. Ooh. And we get the TM37 beat up, which uh, is a poke is a move that one of our Pokemon already knows. Nickets, yes. The user gets all party Pokemon to attack the target. The more party Pokemon, the greater the number of attacks. So if we have six Pokemon on our team, there'll be six attacks. Uh, we can't go down there, unfortunately. Is that a Metapod on top of the tree? No, just a weird top of the tree. That's fine. In England, the berries just grow on trees. Absolutely. Yeah. It, this is exactly England. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Let's friggin' go, boys. Oh, oh, another... Oh, he's ready. Look how ready this kid is. Oh, he's so ready. Oh, let's do it. Every Pokemon's got a type or two, and every type has strong points and weak points. Good for you, lad. He's been waiting. He's been waiting for this moment all his life, our, our lovely lad Peter. Aye. Uh, have you ever wondered what I look like, by the way? That's how it look. My character is what I look like, apart from the glasses, of course. Ooh, new Pokemon alert. Sizzlipede. Okay. Fire and bug, potentially? Look at him. Yeah. It's like a really flat kind of centipede. Oh, he looks pretty cool. Maybe like like the cross between a snake and a centipede. Also, you have a beard. I have a beard as well, yes. I, ha I do have a beard. Like a flatworm, yeah. But he's called Sizzler, so I, I don't know. Is he a fire bug type, I wonder? Has that ever been done? I don't think that's ever been done. Oh, you can't wrap my big boy. You can't do that. 
Please release me, let me go. All right, smash. Beard Crew Twins, yeah. Oh, SPI, oh, there you go, fire move confirmed. Yes, brilliant. Yeah, SPI, I'm part of Team Beard as well. Don't you worry, lad, don't you worry. Uh, we, we gotta have it, SP. You live up north, it's bloody cold right now. If you don't have a beard, your bloody chin's gonna get chilly. Leon! Welcome to the stream. Welcome back, good friend. Hopefully you're well. Hopefully you're well. Volcarona, of course. Yes, well done, Exo. Well done. Yeah, Volcarona's super late game OP, isn't he? Gotta go, but it's uh, good meeting you. Have a, good, have a good stream. Ah, thanks for watching, Nova. Appreciate it. Have a good night, and I'll see you. Hopefully, I'll see you in the future sometime. But yes, have a good night. See you next time. All right, let's uh, bite our way through this Dotler. So we know that Dotler is a psychic and bug type, uh, which is really, really cool. Um, I don't know many psychic and bug type Pokemon. So uh, yeah, we can use the dark move uh, bite in order to get a super effective hit here. Although at the same time, we also don't want to die. Light screen, perfect. We're not gonna be bothering with light screen. Light screen will increase the resistance for special attacks. Thankfully, we will not be using special attacks. We'll be using full physical, baby. Bite that Dottler. There you go. And struggle bug, just a lovely little bug type move. That'll do nicely. Uh, all right, and one more. I wonder if Dottler's good. I wonder if Dottler's good. Bug Psychic with access to Reflect and Light Screen. I wonder if it's got other good moves. I wonder. I wonder. But Yampa gets a level up. Tutel learns Protect, which is very cool. Nickit gets a level up as well. We're getting there. We'll find out. Yeah, we will. I'm weak to people older than me. Nah, kid, you keep fighting, man. I just noticed on the school jumper, by the way, he's got a little blip bug where his uh, school emblem uh, w would normally be. So that's really cool. Uh, some more roly colies here. Ah, oh, cute. Yeah. Yeah, so like pretty much uh, all the schools here, you get your own jumper and it has like the school emblem on it. For example, my school was St. Mary's. So we had like St. Mary's emblem on like a black jumper. Um, so, uh, yeah, there you go. But this time he's got a blip bug because that's uh, his Pokemon, right? So why not? The Galar Mine lies ahead. Beautiful, beautiful. Shall we? Shall we go into a mine, ladies and gentlemen? Let's do it. Let's friggin' do it. Let's do it. Yeah. I mean, we've already beaten up a bunch of miners. Because kids. Let's go into a mine now. <laughs> Hiya! Me and my little sister have set ourselves up as a pop-up Pokemon Center service. Not that we asked anyone if we could or should. Galarmine is pretty rough on the team, isn't it? I'll heal up your Pokemon for you, friend. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. Should we be saving or anything? I don't know how Pokemon works. Uh, we're fine for now. We'll be okay. We won't lose progress. There's, like, if we level up and then die, we won't lose progress. So we're, we're good. So nothing to worry about. And we'll save just to kind of make sure that, you know in case my switch blows up or whatever, but it's not, like, super imperative. Plus, there's auto save. Yeah, exactly, exactly. So it's not, like, super important. But I always like the reminder, so thank you. Appreciate that. Can talk to me anytime you think your team needs a bit of care. Oh, everyone in England, so bloody lovely. Oh, if only that were true. <laughs> oh, there's so many unlovely people in England, unfortunately. More roly colies though. Oh man, I like it. I like it. Ooh. Oh, pretty. Look at all the gems. Oh, I like this. Well, you and your English viewers are the loveliest. Absolutely. I've got the best of the best in here right now for sure. <laughs> so kind. Appreciate that. All right, lad. My work partner and I are in perfect sync, even in battle. Aye, I've been mining down here for 20 years. Even though, unfortunately, in, well, I say unfortunately. Unfortunately for a lot of uh, miners here in England, they lost their jobs when all the coal mines friggin' shut down and all that. But that's fine, that's politics. Let's not talk about that. Let's talk about Rog and Roller instead, who is not a new Pokemon. Um, oh, Rog and Roller is... Oh my god, 
Don't tell me. I want to say Gen 5. I want to say Gen 5. This is the prettiest mine I've ever seen. Yeah, isn't it nice? All the sparkliness and everything. I love it. I love it so much. Uh, we should paralyze you, actually. You're not actually weak to... No resistance to electric, are you? BIB? No problem, my good friend. No problem. I wonder what other Pokemon we'll find down here. We might just find... Um... Oh, do you have a... Ah! Okay, very cool. Uh, we might just find a lot of Rog and Rollers and a lot of Roly Colies, but that's perfectly fine. That's perfectly fine. We'll see, though. We'll see if we can find something uh, interesting in here. Uh, Rock and Roller's ability that keeps activating, uh, its speed will uh, go up by a lot, but its defense will go down uh, by a little each time it activates. So it becomes a lot quicker, but at the cost of its physical defense going down. And as you can see right now, he's actually using moves to raise his physical defense right back up to kind of uh, neutralize the, the the debuff that that last that 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 ability uses. Thankfully, though, our good boy Ampers absolutely chomped his butt and he's gone forever. There you go. Beautiful. Beautiful. Dotler. Um, Dotler's a very defensive Pokemon. There you go. Such a good boy. Such a good boy. Yeah. Scrobot gets the level up too. Very good. Mm, looks like we weren't in sync then. Aye. Aye, you weren't, lad. Aye. Off to pub now. Is it time to clock off? Off to pub? Oh, he's ready for pub. He's, he wants some pub right now. Let's go for a drink, he does, our lad. Uh, what have we got in here, eh? I love this uh, head-on camera view. I like it so much. There we go. All right, what have we got here? Oh, free great balls. Very good indeed. Very good indeed. This music is nuts. I know, right? Craziest mind music ever. <laughs> Welcome back, SP. Welcome back. Hopefully everything is well with you, my good friend. Hopefully everything is well. Oh, 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 this is... Oh, okay. Oh. Ooh, Rock Blast. Very good indeed. Tell us all about Rock Blast. Rock Blast. The user hurls hard rocks at the target. Two to five rocks are launched in a row. Uh, it's all right. It's fine. Thanks, guys. Lovely to have you here on a Saturday night, SP. Lovely to have you here, good sir. Hopefully we'll have some fun tonight, good sir. We streamed this for four hours last night. Oh, hey. Oh, hello, she got us. In order to, go to do good work, I can't slack off on training. Best part of my week? Yay! Good. That's what I want to hear, man. That's what I want to hear. <laughs> Glad I can always be here for you, man. All right, say hello to Timber. Here we go. So Timber was a Gen 5 Pokemon, I believe. I'm testing, testing myself here. Uh, hello, Timber. Yeah, Timber is actually quite a dangerous Pokemon for Yampers because he is a fighting type, and we don't want Yampers to get punched with a fighting type move. So we are going to go to Reboot. Yeah, do you notice... Uh, the, the little kind of chunk of wood in his arm. Timber, chunk of wood. His next evolution, I believe, is called Gerda. And he's got like a metal thing. So, uh, yeah, very, very cool. I, I, li I like him. I like him a lot. Uh, all right. Yep. Yeah, there you go. Friggin' smacking me with 2 by 4 He's like bloody Paxor Jim Duggan from the WWF days. It's a pretty hefty chunk of wood. He's got good wood. That's uh, she, sorry. She's got good wood. She's got the... Loveliest wood I've seen all stream. So, uh, yeah, good wood, that. Good wood. Uh, all right, there we go. What else you got? And another timber. All right, let's do it. Let's friggin' do it. I mean, we're going to set the wood on fire. That's what we're going to do. We're going to friggin' ember and then get that wood on fire. Doo! There you go. I like my little bunny Pokemon. Oh! Oh, it actually clobbered me with its, with its wood. Oh, God. I just got warded. It just slapped me in the face of its ward. God damn it. She has a Lady Timber army. Yeah, this one's a lady too, actually. Isn't that neat? <laughs> so I had to move the iPad because my computer had a fit and stopped working. Oh, I'm sorry. Hopefully everything's working now, my good friend. Welcome back. Welcome back, my good friend. You know you like that KMS. You know you liked that. <laughs> Oh god, it's the Pokemon I hate. Don't worry, I've just smashed two of them. 
Just smash two of them into oblivion. Oh, we got a third one! We got a third one! Just for you, H7, we actually get one you can see. There you go. Oh, and it's another lady! It's another lady. Wow, there you go. All the female timbers, let's do it! Oh, there you go, that's a nice critical hit right there. Oh, low kick. That's gonna do very, very little. And one more ember will do it. Called it, yeah. Dab on that female timber. <laughs> Alright, let's see. There you go. So Yampa gets the level up, moves up to 17 now, which is awesome. Get it away. Don't worry, I'll slay him all day if I need to. There we go. You made... Oh, look how happy she is. <laughs> you made for some good training, you do, Chuck. Aye. Right. Cheers for that one, love. There you go. Alright, um... Alright, where are we going now? She's so cute. I know, right? I love that smile. Ooh, what do we have here? Scary face. So TN26 scary face will reduce the speed of our opponent. Unfortunately, not very useful. The user frightens the target with a scary face to harshly lower its, lower its speed stat. Not too useful for a casual playthrough. Probably not too useful for competitive either. I, I don't use it much, but I'm sure there's some use for it. Oh! Oh, no! Give me, give me, give me, no! Oh! Alright, we'll catch this. We'll catch this guy then. Oh, we got some Pokemon to catch here, boys. Oh, very good. So that Pokemon that I just saw is called Drillba, and Drillba is incredibly strong, but unfortunately it got away from us. All right, so we'll catch Timber, first of all. Sorry, H7, I know I said this would be the last one, but uh, here's one more. <laughs> You'll get one? Oh, I hope so. Drillba's so good. Will lurk and sleep at the same time. That's all right, lad. Don't worry about it. Uh, just have a nice, relaxing lurk, man. Streams here if you uh, if you want it, my good friend. <laughs> uh, right. Let's see if we can catch this guy so we can end Hate Seven's nightmare. All right. Great ball on half health. One, two, three. Yeah. We're kind of hoping one of these catches actually fails because Yampa's ability is that uh, on the first ball that you fail, um, he'll actually fetch the ball for you and give it to you back, which is hilarious. Uh, but yeah, Timber, the muscular Pokemon. It loves helping out with construction projects. It loves it so much that if it uh, that if rain causes work to halt, it swings its log around and throws a tantrum. Aww. So, not like real builders then, because I guess... If it started raining, then they'd all bugger off. Um, you got that word. We got that word. Woo! Oh, really, Coley. Uh, there's a sparkly here. Hardstone. Very good. So this will raise the power of rock types. All right, let's go get this Woobat. Say hello to Woobat. Another Gen 5 Pokemon, I believe. Very, 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 very cool indeed. All right, so Woobat. I love it. Yeah, it's got a little heart on his nose. Isn't that good? Alright, so let's nuzzle. This won't kill, surely. No. Fuzzy Bat Boy? I know, right? It's pretty cool. I do like Woo Bat. Whenever I play um, Gen 5 Pokemon, I do pick up a Woo Bat because uh, I think they're pretty neat. I think they're pretty unique looking. <laughs> uh, Ghost Flying type move will not do much to us because we are an electric type, so we will, res we will resist it. And we will throw a Pokeball to catch the Woobat. There you go. When I said that I'm going to catch as many Pokemon as I can, you bet your ass that I'm actually going to catch every Pokemon that I can. It's going to happen, man. Only one we're only on one health, though? Nah, don't worry. Yampers is fine. He's, he's a trained professional. <laughs> Living life on the edge. I love its one tooth. I know, right? Isn't it, isn't it lovely? <laughs> Oh, 11? Oh, yeah, sorry, 11. That's that's fine, then. He's been on one. It's all good. Yeah, look at that single tooth, though. I love it. It looks like he could, like, open cans. You know, like, cans of food. You know, just smashes his uh, tooth into the can and then just eats all of its contents. Uh, but, yeah, Woobat, the Bat Pokemon. While inside a cave, if you look up and see a lot of heart-shaped marks lining the walls, it's evidence that Woobat lives there. Adorable, right? Friggin' adorbs. All right, into box you go, lad. Into box you go. All right, we're not interested in any more roly colies, but we are interested in giving Yampa 
a couple of potions here. There we go. All right, sweet. Good lad, good lad. Right, let's continue. All right, love. Working women are good at Pokemon battles too, you know, you bugger. There you go. All right, let's do it. Everyone's getting a Norman, a Northern voice today, apparently. <laughs> All right, time for Diglett. Good old Diglett dig. Right, and we got Yampers. Now, unfortunately for Yampers, Diglett is immune to Nuzzle, and um, yeah, is if he does use a ground type move, Yampers is got, probably going to suffer because of it. We are going to use Tackle just to see how much damage we take. Scratch won't do a whole lot. But any kind of ground move probably will do quite a bit. Thankfully, it looks like a two-hit KO. Growl will do nothing apart from lower our attack. So that means we'll probably be a three-hit KO now. Let's see. So our attack power will go down. Tackle will not two-hit KO. Please don't use Earthquake. Astonish is fine. That's a ghost-type move. Oh, is it not? Is it not a ghost-type move? Am I not normal? I thought I was normal-type Pokemon. How does Astonish work? I don't know how Astonish works anymore. <laughs> Apparently, I don't know how Astonish works. Oh, here we go. Okay, so this was the Pokemon I wanted to catch, but missed, unfortunately. This is Drillba. Drillba evolves into probably one of the strongest Pokemon in Gen 5, uh, which is uh, quite frightening. Look at him. I know, right? He's super cool. His evolution's super cool as well. OP? Yeah, friggin' Drillba. Uh, Drillba's used in the speedrun as well, so uh, yeah, very, very powerful Pokemon indeed. Uh, you're not Steel yet, are you? Oh god, even the Rapid Spin is hurting Exo. He a little mole boy, I know, right? This is so cool. I like his claws. His claws look amazing. Alright, we are not strong enough for this. Let's swap out for a boot. There's a speedrun route for- oh, right. Oh, no, not for this game, for Generation 5. I meant- I, I mean, I'm, I'm sure there will be a, a speedrun for this game very, very soon, but no, I meant for Gen 5, uh, uh, Excadrill is used for that one, for sure. Uh, Alright, let's double kick you. God, could you imagine that? Speedrun this game on day one, get first world record. Oh, TJ, have you seen how Great Peony have been doing this footy season? They have been doing pretty well, haven't they? I'm very impressed. I've, I'm so used to Peony like, getting to the playoffs and then losing. Um, they're very good at that. Uh, but yeah, no, looking good. I never got to play Gen 5 since I didn't have it. Oh. A lot of people rip on it. I think it's okay. I quite like it. <laughs> I quite like it. I think it's good. There we go. I would, in mean, I would, in the meanwhile, play red and gold on my Game Boy. Ah, nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that. Second in the league at the moment, I'm Hyde. Oh, I hope we make it, dude. I hope we make it. Automatic promotion would be lovely. So, Scrovert, our chubby cheeks little squirrel, wants to learn Stockpile. Uh, yeah, why not? Stockpile's not the worst. Oh, it actually has a new move as well. So new move, Stuffed Cheeks. The user eats its held berry, then sharply raises its defense stat. Very cool. For Stockpile, the user charges up power and raises both its defense and special defense. Is it good defense? Yeah, it's got good defense, isn't it? Amazing. There we go. I need to learn all of these new moves, so I will be looking at all of them. So, uh, yeah, apologies if uh, it doesn't interest you guys too much. Oh, it wants to learn Swallow as well. Very good. So yeah, Stockpile and Swallow. The power stored using the move Stockpile is absorbed by the user to heal its HP. Storing more power heals more HP. You can't have Stockpile without Swallow. Well, you can really, but um, I'm, I'm not going to be using Scrobot, so we'll just get rid of Bite. I'm interested. I like learning them. Oh, well, there you go. There you go. So yeah, the strategy would be you'd uh, use Stockpile three times, and that would raise both your defense and... Um, uh, special defense, and then you'd use uh, Swallow. <laughs> this is going to sound so weird. <laughs> you Swallow to gain healing based off how many stockpiles you've uh, you've used, or you use Spit Up, which will do more damage for the amount of stockpiles you've done. Yeah, I know, I know. <laughs> so yeah, sp uh, Spit Up is your offensive stockpile move, whilst uh, Swallow is your uh, health regaining move. I know, it's strange, it's strange. 
<laughs> Nickit wants to learn assurance. Assurance is pretty good. We don't mind assurance, so we'll get rid of Snarl for that. Yeah, Stockpile is, uh... It's... Stockpile's fun. I like Stockpile. Um, the other two moves, not used too much. You're a Pokemon. I want to scout them. Well, you can't, love. I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright, uh... Okay, so we want to dodge the Woobats. Uh, we've got ourselves a Diglett. We actually have a Diglett, because we caught a big Diglett, didn't we? Uh, we've got ourselves an Aether, which will restore 10 PP to a move. Uh, oh, 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 look at him, look at him, he's ready to go, isn't he? You found a pair of heavy-duty boots. Yeah, we got the giant diglet, didn't we? Yeah. These boots prevent the effects of traps set on the battlefield. Ooh, okay. I think I know that. I know that from somewhere. That might be from a previous game. But either way, I was looking around for items, but I found a trainer instead. Ugh. Oh. All right, here we go. Come on, Russell. Let's do it. Oh, let's have let's have a battle against this Roly Coley. All right, Yampers. Uh, you're on 11 health, right? Or did we heal you? I oh, know you're on 22, right? Don't push this in your item pocket, did? <laughs> yeah, don't do that, lad. Don't do that, you bugger. Um. All right, we're gonna use Nuzzle to uh, paralyze it. Oh, it's not a lot of damage. It's not a lot of damage. I was saying that he's not doing much damage either, so this is fine. It's going to be a slow battle day, ladies and gentlemen. I need to see uh, Yampa's evolution, if he even has one, um, is going to make this quite a slow day. But we're going to be streaming for a while, I'd say, today, so we'll probably be all right. Uh, all right, one more nuzzle. One more nuzzle before we have to heal. There you go. There you go. Oh, okay. No, he's paralyzed, so we can go for one more nuzzle. We're just going to nuzzle all day long. Having a lovely nuzzle, we are. Super fun at any speed. Okay, good, good, good. Good, that's the main thing. That's the main thing. Right, we're going to heal you up, lad. We're going to heal you up. There you go. Take that, you good boy. <laughs> I, I, I've been saying this, like, before the game even released. I was like... I am going to have a Yamper on my team, and I'm going to obsess over it, like, so much. So, uh, you're welcome, ladies and gentlemen. You're welcome. Right. God, the rapid spin. He's just gaining so much speed. You are welcome, KMS. You are welcome. <laughs> Corgis for days. So, yeah, the effect of rapid spin having, uh, speed, um... Is actually amazing. Like, you know, gaining speed from Rapid Spin, it means that he's actually able to go first, even through the paralysis. For me, it's Corvusquire. Ooh, very good, very good. I have a feeling I know that Pokemon. If only I used an item eff effectively when I was in a pinch. Aye. We haven't seen one of those yet? No, but I know the name Corvi, so I might know. Um, Kind of what that Pokemon looks like. Very cool. Can't wait to see. I assume I can't go up there, right? No. Okay. Uh, all right. Let's see over here. All right. Two super potions. Uh, we actually could do with a super potion. So uh, yeah, let's do it. We've been kind of healing uh, our main guy with uh, regular potions, but um, we'll just use super potions for now. Although saying that, the trainer that's just through this door over here is probably going to heal all my Pokemon. Oh, oh no, it's Moody Lad! Or girl, or person. Coming this way, I'd advise against it. Any trainer with a wishing star is in for a beating from me and my Pokemon. Mm. We met this person at the uh, at the registration for the Pokemon Gym Challenge, didn't we? Yeah, here we... Or did we? Or was that different? No, we did, I think. I think we did. There are a few Pokemon revealed months before release, like the Flower Dog Sheep. Yeah, and the bird you haven't seen yet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, for sure. You... You're the gym challenger endorsed by the champion, aren't you? What a joke. You're aware that the chairman is more important than the champion, right? I was chosen by the chairman himself, so that makes me more amazing than you. 
Oh, here we go. I suppose I should prove be beyond doubt just how pathetic you and you are and how strong I am. Um, so, Wulu, Yampa, Gossifler, and yeah, the Core of Esquire folk. Um, Pokemon Trader, uh, Bead? Bead, is it? I don't know, I'm not very good with names. All right, so we get Solosis, another Gen 5 Pokemon. Very strong Gen 5 Pokemon. Was a big fan of Reuniclus and all that back in the day. Uh, psychic type Pokemon, so let's go with a bite. I'd say it the same way you're saying it, but I have no idea. Yeah, I don't know either. I don't know either. I'm just giving your Pokemon a little chance to get ready or whatever you just said. There you go, Solosis. Solosis is a very, very good special attacker, so uh, we might take a bit of special damage here. Yeah, there's a Saint Bead, and it's pronounced like that. Is it? Very good. Okay, good. Thank you. Oh, yeah, there is. I think I have a Saint Beads. Well, I think I've been to a Saint Beads. Not literally. Uh, I've been around it. I've seen it. Yeah, there we go. I think. Have I? I don't know. Either way, we have Gafita. They're using a lot of Gen 5 Pokemon. Uh, but yeah, Gafita, another Psychic-type Pokemon here. Ouch! Poor Yampus. Here we go. Bite will do quite the number here. Just about half. Very tanky. Uh, all right. Let's uh, hopefully not take too, da too much damage from this side beam. We're doing fine. We're doing fine. Soon there's a trend of more than average amount of Gen 5s. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Um, I mean, for a person like you that's not played it, that's perfect, isn't it? But, uh, yeah, man. I, I mean, that's perfectly fine. I like Gen 5. Gen 5's great. This is fine? Yeah, we're doing fine. Don't you worry. All right, Reboot has finally learned a half-decent fire move. Flame Charge. Cloaking itself in flame, the user attacks the target. Then building up more power, the user raises its speed stats. So we are going to replace Ember with Flame Charge. Flame Charge is excellent. This makes Reboot super useful now. All right, beautiful. All right, any more for any more? Hatena, this is a new Pokemon. Um, all right, Yampers, you've done you've done well, lad. Uh, lad, yeah, but it's time for Reboot. Hey, DJ. Hey, Kragan. How you doing, bud? Hopefully you're well, my good friend. Oh, dear. What have I been doing? Well, whatever. Let's bring out my Hatana. Ooh. It's like a sleep cap kind of thing. That's an interesting looking Pokemon. All right. All right, Hatana. What have you got for me? All right. Well, you're not weak to fire. That's good. Am I fighting type yet? No, okay. Bad migraines? Oh, I'm sorry, dude. Migraines are awful. Holy crap. Like, even just light migraines are a pain. Hopefully you feel better soon, man. Try and take it easy if you can. They're all so cute. I know, right? I love the kind of, like, flopsy kind of hat on top of Hatena. Very cool. I see. Well, that's fine. Wasn't really trying all that hard anyway. Look at that Rolex on, on the wrist. Holy crap. Dang, this uh, this one is ballin'. Well, that was unexpected. I suppose you're more able than I thought. Yeah, get wrecked, nerd. You'd sell them. <laughs> Naturally, I remember your battle style and strategies now. I'm sure it's easily defeat you, if defeat you if and when we face each other in an official match. Now that we've established that, I won't waste any more time on you. I've already gathered every wishing star in this area. What does he? What does? What does he want with all the wishing stars? I dab on that fool. Absolutely. Let's friggin' dab on that nerd. If only we could. <laughs> Wait, we can whistle, right? There you go. We'll whistle on that fool. There you go. <laughs> we did it. We passed through the uh, the coal mine. Oh, oh, and this must be that lady's sister. Hey, girl, how you doing? Hiya! Me and my big sister have set up, uh, set ourselves up as a pop-up Pokemon Center service. Not that we asked anyone if we, oh, you've already had this before. You've done a good job making it this far. I'll heal your team up for you. 
Cheers, love. Appreciate it. She looks like a young Celine Dion. Every night in my dreams. Uh, once you get through Galar Mine, you're out on Route 4 and nearly to Turffield. You're almost there, Jim Challenger. Mr. Ray Coma! How you doing, bud? Wow! Hopefully you're well, Mr. Ray. One of my friggin' oldest viewers ever. God love you. In terms of time watch, not, uh, age. <laughs> yeah, I've been playing Rust and trying to get over these migraines. You're playing Rust and with a migraine? Dude, you're friggin' hardcore, man. Friggin' hardcore. <gasps> oh, you're a child! I thought you were a Pokemon. God damn it. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> But yeah, lovely Mr. Ray Koma. Hopefully you're well, my good friend. Hopefully you're well. But yeah, glad you've been able to chill, man. Also, do you see Rusty's coming to console in 2020? Is it? Wow, very cool. Camping with your Pokemon, playing together, cooking together. These are all great ways to come closer with your Pokemon. You're welcome to stop by my camp too if you'd like. Nah, you're all right, love. You're all right. Let's take on this tough lad over here. All right, tough lad. Uh, I got Grookey on my copy of Sword. Nice, we got Score Bunny. Hopefully you're having a lot of fun with Grookey. Can't catch children now. Unfortunately, unfortunately not. No, unfortunately it wasn't a Pokemon. And fortunately we can't catch children. My God, um, I'm weird. <laughs> You'll love crossplay and it's going to be broken crap. Yeah, I can imagine that. Uh, all right. I'm doing special training while camping to train my Pokemon. The finishing touch will be a battle with you. There we go. There we go. Let's do it. Oh, look at him. Just... Oh, look at him. Just kind of cradle the Pokeball. Oh, that's cool. I like that. Oh, isn't he adorable? All right, let's go. We got... What the hell is that? What the hell? What the hell is that? What did they do to me, Alf? They, what did they do to me, Alf? <laughs> oh man! Oh yeah, that'd be pretty hard on controller, Krogan. Sounds like it would be anyway. It's a mangy meow. Yeah, don't you drugs kids? <laughs> Gotta make of it. Yeah, that. I mean, I'm gonna imagine that's his. Um, that's his galar form. I'm gonna imagine KMS. Um, Holy crap, though. Like Zigzagoon, yeah, exactly, yeah. Oh, that's interesting. I like that, I like that. It's kind of nutty, it looks ferocious, doesn't it? Well, apart from the smiling, of course. Oh, interesting, tackle not very effective. Tackle not very effective means that it must be rock or steel, I guess? Curious. Yeah, it must be like a rock or steel type, right? What else does, uh, what else resist normal? Um, oh, it'd be easier with control? Ah, name assist? Ah, fair enough. Well, I probably won't be getting it, so it's, it's, uh, it's all good. Um, but it's cool, it's got crossplay at least. That's pretty neat. It looks deranged. It looks like it's been on a desert island for a bit too long, and it's grown a beard and gone a bit feral. <laughs> Uh, yeah, that's that's what it looks like to me. Um, so yeah, I mean, Meowth got an Alolan form as well. We're doing like no damage here. We need to switch out. It got an Alolan form as well, which was um, uh, like purple, right? Yeah. Started talking to volleyballs. Yeah. Well said. <laughs> All right. Let's see if we can confirm its type here. So. Yes, so uh, as it is weak to fire, it must be a steel type. There you go, beautiful. Must be a steel type then. That's interesting. That's so cool. So a steel type meow. It's like a little Tas Yeah, Tasmanian Devil. Oh, that's so good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that's good. I like that. All right, we got C dot now. Now does C dot look any different? No, C dot doesn't look any different. That's fine. Uh, C dot Gen Free Pokemon. Does your revolution touch that me off? Yeah, exactly. That's really cool. <laughs> On Tasmanian Devils, uh, black and white. Well, I mean, like if you look at Taz from the Tasmanian Devil cartoon, like he was all brown and crazy looking, wasn't he? Um, so yeah. 
Uh, all right, and we got a Butterfree as well. Let's take a look at Butterfree. Just the shape mostly. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Looks very cool though. All right, so Butterfree, classic uh, bug and flying type there. Of the ca cartoon one. Yeah, I used to love the cartoon one. Cartoon Tasmanian Devil, very cool. <laughs> oh, dang, we got a lot of experience there. Holy crap, almost everyone leveled up. Love it. So, Tootle got a level, Dotler got a level, Scrovet got a level, Nickit got a level. Very good. I was sure my Pokemon were in top condition. Yeah, well, they weren't, lad. Nice, yeah. Chunky level up there. Love it. <gasps> oh, another Yampus! Ah, adorable. Oh, man. Is there anything more wonderful than a Yampus running through a cornfield? Or whatever this is. Wheat. I don't know. Um, what do you think? I look just like a Pikachu, right? Yeah, you do, lad. Yeah, you do. All right, let's go get Shane. Shane. <laughs> oh. Oh, Pika. Kid in the Pika costume. Adorbs. I know, right? Isn't it wonderful? <laughs> All right, let's crush his dreams. All right, Pikachu. Pikachu, Electro Ball. So electric type moves are not going to do too much damage to us. Pikachu does have a nifty special attack stat, but we are pretty chunky and we resist the electric moves. So it's not going to be an issue. Quick attacks are not going to do too much either. We'll tank that all day long. Pretty sure that kid is a furry. <laughs> Maybe he's developing into one. Maybe, maybe when he's uh, 30 years old, he'll think, Oh man, I used to love it when I was dressed as a Pikachu back in the day. I'm going to keep doing it. <laughs> in training. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Right now, he doesn't know the concept of furry, but as he learns, he'll get, he'll, he'll get it. He'll get it. What's up, Krogan? What's up, my good friend? What's up? Oh, I love how Pikachu still has his uh, actual regular voice. Very good. I passed one of my things that I'm learning. Ooh, congratulations, my good friend. The professor has been out for two months and you've already, and you've passed it. You passed something even though your professor's been out for two months. Amazing. You, sir, are a friggin' super genius. Automatics passed. Well done, man. Well done. Pika! Oh, very good, man. Should be proud of yourself. Well done. Puberty's gone weird for him? Kinda. <laughs> oh! Pumpkaboo! That is actually a um, that is actually a 30 year old man in a Pikachu outfit. He just looks very small. So yes, yeah, say hello to Pumpkaboo. All right, let's see what we can do here. So yeah, so Pumpkaboo is Grass and Ghost, I believe. Spooky Pumpkin, yeah, yeah, he's a cool Pokemon. That's the best thing I've ever seen. What Pumpkaboo? I know, right? Isn't he cool? <laughs> Uh, she, sorry. Um, I want him. Uh -huh, sorry. We're gonna have to switch. Reboot. Let's go. Tutorial. Uh, but get an automatic pass. Oh, you all got an automatic pass. Oh, very cool. Nice, nice. Puffy pumpkin bridges. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's being quite annoying right now. I'm not gonna lie. It's loot seeding me and it's avoiding all of my uh, attacks. How dare it. Uh, flame attack will just ravage it, right? Shadow sneak, ghost type move. All right, come on. Let's do it. Let's do it. And... Ah, we killed it. God damn it. We knocked it out. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. Reboot's too strong for his own good. <laughs> Ravage it, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, took out the uh, took out the grass type there. It's fine. It helps keep wild Pokemon away if the holder is the head of the party. Very cool. <gasps> There's Eevees in the next field. Oh, another block of Nice. Too strong. Yeah, yeah. Like uh, unfortunately, Ampers was just getting a wee bit too tangled there. He was confused and everything. So, uh... oh, it took my silver scarf. Oh. All right, this is fine now. This is fine. All right, raise and leave. Did you crit me? Yampers, no! Ah! Yes. God damn it. Sorry, Yamps. <laughs> our good boy. It's all right. He's just having a sleep. It's all good. He's just having a sleep. 
All right, you know what, Pumpkaboo, for that, you're dead. Screw you, Pumpkaboo. God damn it, Pumpkaboo, how dare you. <laughs> uh, Yampus won't get an experience for that. God damn it. We do have a revive. I don't mind uh, using a revive on him. Being very wasteful with a lot of these, but you know what, for Yampus, it's worth it. It's worth it. Are there any TMs we can teach Yamps that will help him here? Uh, Swift wouldn't help him. Um, no, not really. Choose my number? Oh, yeah, I, I let my viewers choose my number yesterday. Uh, uh, 616. Go with that. <laughs> Alright, what have we got here? Oh, we got an electric. Very cool, very cool. Alright, Yampus is back in action, so nothing to worry about. By the way, if Yampus doesn't learn Body Slam, I'll be very disappointed. He looks like a, a dog which should know uh, Body Slam. <laughs> Alright, let's go catch this Electrike. So Electrike, Gen 3 Pokemon. You might remember it from my Sapphire playthrough. Uh, let's friggin' smash it a few times. Get that Pokemon count up. And tackle. I love how he wiggles his butt before he uh, flings himself over there to attack. Love it. I think it looks a bit... Uh, it looks different a bit, though. Uh, I think it's still the same model. Well, it's still the same. It's basically still the green and yellow. Um, it does have an evolved form, which is blue and yellow, called Manetric. Oh! oh he broke out the Pokeball. A day! Oh! Oh, but Yampus is holding the, the Silk Scarf now, so... <laughs> It won't retrieve the ball. Yeah, it only works if he's empty. He's actually holding the silk scarf. Ah, that's a problem. Okay. Oh, I know, right? I've literally only just realized that. God damn it. We kind of want the silk scarf for now because tackle is actually a viable move for him. But at the same time, uh, it'd be really cool to kind of get our Pokeballs back. <laughs> Electrike, the lightning Pokemon. It stores static electricity in its fur for discharging. It gives us sparks of a storm approaches. Very cool, very cool indeed. All right, let's get rid of you. Center box. All right, what else do we have here? Got a Yampas there. We've got an item here. Paralyzed heal, very good. What are you? Oh, here we go. All right, all right, we got Savage Meowth. <laughs> All right, Steel Type Meowth. Now, we technically own one of these because we have a regular Meowth. Get him? Yeah, we're going to get him. We're going to get him because I want this this Galar form. Uh, let's paralyze it a wee bit. Let's paralyze it a wee bit, and then um, I am going to switch to Reboot to do the rest of the damage. I just think it looks pretty neat. <laughs> Imagine going down a dark alley and seeing that fella there. Like, holy crap. Oh, he's such an angry boy as well. He's such an angry boy. Right, we need to lower its health a little bit here. So we're going to use a weak move like uh, Quick Attack. We use Quick Attack. Quick Attack will be a really weak move. We don't want to kill it. Both of our moves that we have are uh, super effective against this Meowth because, uh, well just because. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, let's lower the attack a wee bit first. All right, go get him, Reboot. Lovely Reboot. Lovely. Bloody lovely Reboot. Bloody lovely. Uh, we are going to have to, like, find the next town very soon because I'm very well aware that we're running out of healing items. Oh, no, we can go back to the lady. We can go back to the lady. She'll heal our Pokemon for us. All right, no, we're good. Ninja Bunny. Yeah. I love him. I actually really like him. He's grown on me so much. Such a big fan of that. Uh, Alright, we'll just use a Pokeball here. Alright, go get him! Go back to the mine. Yeah, yeah, there's a lady at the uh, exit of the mine who will heal us, so we can just go back to her. Yeah! Click! I'm catching all the Pokemon! Ah, there we go. Beautiful. This is my life now, guys. <laughs> Alright, there we go. So we now have a crazy Meowth. Very cool. Very cool. Uh, nope. No more. Nope, no more. Leave me alone. Nope, Yampus. Lamp Yampus, I love you, but leave me alone. Uh, oh, hello. 
There you go. A dose of energy powder. A very bitter medicinal powder. It can be used to restore 60 HP to a single Pokemon. Very cool. Very cool indeed. Gonna catch them all? Yeah, we do. We're gonna catch them all. Woo! This day, the feeling of my jaw wide shut still feels weird. Oh, I can't imagine how it would feel, dude. Cannot imagine how it would feel. Holy crap. You're a warrior for going through it, lad. You're a warrior for going through it. Look at this view, by the way. Oh. I don't appreciate England's views. Like, if you took me to this, to this, the equivalent of this in England, I'd be like, eh. But here, right now, I actually think it's pretty good. <laughs> Friggin' gorgeous. I know, right? And you can see, like, that fancy houses over there just to the right. And you've got the stadium down there. Oh, so good. So good. I love it. Friggin' love it. All right. What have we got here? Ooh, shiny. There you go. Got ourselves a repel. And we got a bunch of diglets. Very cool. Oh, hello. Okay, right. Uh, got ourselves a pile of silver powder. An item to be held by a Pokemon. It's a shiny silver powder that will boost the power of bug type moves. Very handy to have that. Just in case and just in case we do go for a bug type. Uh, Alright, just mainly Meowth and Diglets. What about you, Eevee Kid? No one appreciates the views where uh, the views where they're from. Yeah, exactly. Isn't that true? Isn't that a thing? Tight like braces, if you had them. Nah, I never had them. Never had them, but I was told it was like it, but everything was wide shut. Ah. No, I never had them. Never had them. Okay, now I say, a wild poker kid appears, because I'm an Eevee. Yay! Oh, look at the little Eevee girl. A little Eevee girl called Sunny. Sunny! Ooh, a milfery! <gasps> we did it! We found the coffee Pokemon! <laughs> All right, let's figure out what you are. Are you a ghost? No, you resist dark. We should introduce that to Pika Boy. Yeah, these have fun. Oh man, woo, coffee. All right, okay. Are you water? Let's find out. You paralyze, which is good. Um, hmm, what type could it be? Kind of like braces, but much worse. Well, well, hopefully I don't need it. Reminds me of uh, Sunny from Gold Silver. Ah, uh, yeah, a little bit. Yeah, nice. Yeah, yeah, I see it. I see it. Oh, look at the wag little tail. Oh, draining. Oh, fairy. Fairy type. What do you reckon? Looks weird. Oh, I think it looks pretty cool. No, it's not a fairy, right? I don't know. It's hard trying to work out uh, what type of Pokemon everything is. <laughs> Alright, Sweet Scent's not going to do a whole lot. That's all, the only that's going to do is just lower the evasiveness, which means that really inaccurate moves from Milsery will actually uh, hit us now. But that's perfectly fine. There goes Milsery. You going for Psychic? Hey, it won't be Psychic, so it was uh, resistant to Dark. So... Yeah, I don't know. We could, we might be able to check in the Pokedex. We'll see. Oh, it's already over? Yeah, it is. I wonder if the Pokedex actually tells us. Uh, let's see. I don't know if the Pokedex will record it. Let's find out. Uh, Milsery. Fairy. Yes, there we go. So Milsery is a fairy type. Uh, are there any others we want to look at? Uh, let's see here. So this will confirm all the ones that we're not too sure about. Uh, I don't want to look at this too much, actually. We've got 24 Pokemon so far. Really, Coley. Uh, yes, yeah, Sizzlipede. So this was a fire bug. Very cool. Again, only one other example of that, like Exo said with uh, Volcarona. Uh, Gossifler, pure grass. Um. What else do we have? Anything new? Uh, McBray, you're not new. Final Light, you're not new. Uh, Yampers, we know. Tootle, we'll know. Um, okay, all right, cool. Uh, that's good. Yeah, it's good that we're able to kind of uh, work that out now, thanks to the Pokedex. Very, very cool. Wooloo! Where do you think you're going, Wooloo? Meh! <laughs> All right, what have we got? Oh, look at the Wooloo! Oh, no! Wooloo crashed into you and stopped. 
Okay, I need to change the voice because he does not look like uh, a girly voice kind of lad. Ma, are you okay? You took that tackle head on. Hmm. Oh, you must be one of those gym challengers, right? I mean, could be. Absolutely. Uh, we did meet this guy at the uh, the gym ceremony, the gym registration ceremony, thankfully. I believe his name is Milo? Um, yeah, indeed I am, actually. Ah, I thought so. I saw you at the opening ceremony. My name's Milo. I am the gym leader and, a ra and rather partial to grass-type Pokemon. I've been itching to see just how good the champion endorsed gym challenges are. Let me find out at the gym stadium. Just head on through this route and you'll run right into my stadium. See you there. Come on now, back to the stadium with you too. We can't keep the gym challenges waiting. There we go. Oh, there you go, lovely Milo. He's a good lad. Not nice, nice simple lad. He's a simple lad. He's built, built like a farmer, you know. He lugs old sheep around. Oh, oh, hello. I saw something from... I think I saw something from Exo there. I wish it would show on this. Yeah, there's something from Exo in the bottom left-hand corner, I reckon. Is that you, Exo? Aren't you a Tony? Sorry if I just revealed your name. <laughs> Let me know if that's actually you. Alright, let's get two X accuracies as well. Yeah, that's me. Cool. Very nice. Alright. Oh, here we go. It's hot. Hop's here, and we're here in Turf Field. We made it. Look, just take a look at that, Dan. That's Turf Field Stadium down there. Our first Pokemon gym battle is inside that stadium. The gym leader just returned too. Milo is his name, but the place is jam-packed with challenges. It'll be ages before our turn comes up. Oh, but Sonia was looking for you, Dan. What do you think of the game's Fakachu? Have I seen the Fakachu yet? I don't know if I've even seen it yet. Have I? She wanted to ask you about something. She tried asking me, but I had no idea. This new gem don't make gym, makes gyms not look crap? No, oh, alright. <laughs> they do look pretty impressive here. She's open, what's her face hill? You know the one. What, you don't know the hill? Well, have a look at your map if you're not sure. Oh. Oh, Bow Wow. Oh, Yampus. Hey, bud. The one that looked like an off-color ghost Pikachu. Ah. Uh, oh, I think I, know, I think I know the one you mean. Um, oh, sorry. Missed that one. Such a good boy. Such a good Yampus. I'm going to assume it's this way. But we're going to go to the Pokemon Center first. There we go. Such a good boy. All right. Let's do it. Hello, and welcome to the Pokemon Center. Would you like to rest your Pokemon? The one, the pretty black... Ah, yeah. No, okay. No, I remember. I remember. Oh, you think she's pretty. <laughs> oh, man. Follow the Yampers? Yeah, let's do it. Let's go find that Yampers. Let's go find him. All right. Yampers, where did you go, my good friend? Here we go. Bowark! <laughs> what are you two talking about? If you've never seen it before, you should really go see the amazing scenery from the hilltop. In fact, you should go see it again if you, if you have seen it before. That geoglyph, I heard nobody knows its name. Maybe it was forbidden. It was a forbidden name or something. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. Welcome to the town of Turffield. Alright, renowned since days of yore, nice, for the stunning and historical geoglyph upon our hill. Yeah, uh, yore was a natural... Uh, like, historical time period here in England. Yes, uh, the uh, days of yore. I'm kidding. Um, Alright. Uh, oh, here we go. Are you a battler? Oh, no, you're just a happy lady. I took a photo of the geoglyph, but it just doesn't compare to seeing it yourself. Still, looking at the photo is enough to bring back a rush of emotions. Lovely. Bloody lovely. Bow, wow, wow, wow. Alright, there he goes. Go get him, Yampus. Go get him. Alright, uh... Yes, you'll learn a lot of history, <laughs> fake history from me throughout this entire playthrough, I'm sure. <laughs> uh, right, anything else around here? Ooh, all right, fella. You like a, you like that bit of rock, don't you? Such mystery structure. That's it. Can't read. This game's killed me. Best lore on Twitch? You bet your ass it is. <laughs> 
such mysterious stone structures? Were they made by people or by Pokemon? Who knows, eh? Uh, cashing in on all that Stonehenge goodness, right? There you go. <gasps> Ooh, Leaf Stone. Have we caught a grass type Pokemon? I don't know if we have. Uh, what am I in here? Have we caught a grass type Pokemon? We caught Gossiflare, didn't we? Ooh, wonder if Gossiflare evolves by Leaf Stone. Interesting. Oh, cool! I see it in the back. Thanks, Yamper. Bow, wow, wow! Look at Yamper. Adorable. <laughs> I'm so glad we got one. I had you come because I wanted to hear what you thought. For the what? For the Yamper? Best Pokemon. I have a Thunderstone. Have you? Where'd you pick that from? Pick, pick that up from. His face. I know, the little dangly tongue. I love it. <laughs> so, that Geoglyph. What do you think of it? Um, uh, it shows the darkest day. A wild area. Ah, very good. Right, perceptive of you. Especially since the portion depicting the black storm has mostly disappeared. A long time ago, a great black storm covered the Galar region. Giant Pokemon uh, ran rampant. But what was the black storm... They called the darkest day. What connection does it have to Dynamax? Oh, look at that twirl that hair. Love it. Guess I'm the lucky lady who'll be looking into that. Grand sure gives me a lot to do. Thanks for your thoughts on the matter. As thanks, I'll give you a lead card. Oh, we got a lead card. Oh, I got Milo's lead card. <laughs> I want her lead card. Milo is a grass type gym leader. Things will go well for you if you use fire flying, or bug-type moves. Take these two. Be pretty bad if your Pokemon weren't in fighting form. Why, thank you. Appreciate the two revives. Go on, then. Get yourself to Turf Field Stadium and battle yourself silly. Die! <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's waiting little pause. <laughs> no Sonya selfies for you. I know, right? And there's a thing here. Come on, Sonya. Oh. Oh, that kid's laughing. You see the kid bottom left? Oh, he's laughing. Ah, oh, cute. I know, right? Oh, I want to be the rock, though. Wah. God damn it. Just like real life, I'm not the rock. Feels bad. Bottle of fresh water, though. Always very handy. You have to stand on a box? Yeah, I do. I'm such a shorty. There you go. Feels bad, man. What do you think, Kit Cliff, then, love? Oh, you know what I think? I think Geoglyph was created with help of Pokemon. No, it's actually some prankster with a lawnmower. He's been doing it for years. What about you, fella? Oh, I could Geoglyph drawn ages ago. Last for so long without eroding away. It's so perplexing. If I think too much about it, I won't be able to sleep. Aye. <laughs> hey, Dead X. So this is what the entire world is streaming and playing today. I know, right? And they were doing it yesterday as well, Dead X. I decided to stream it despite it having 180,000 followers. But that's fine, because we're having fun. <laughs> How you doing today, Dead X? Hopefully you're well, my good friend. Hopefully you're bloody well. Welcome to England. I'll whistle at you. There you go. Beautiful. Right, so we... Oh, hello, little girl. A treasure lies buried somewhere in Turfield. According to this treasure map, the trick to finding the treasure lies in the standing stones. Seek yourself three standing stones with grass before the other ones. Use, what, use well that strength and find them the strength of its strength in the end. My god, what a sentence. Uh, dally not if you've a mind to find what time has left behind. That's what it says, but I can't make heads or tails of it. Uh... I want to make heads or tails of it. I've already picked it up. Uh, okay, we'll think about that later, I guess. Um, all right, fair enough. But yeah, glad you're well, my good friend. Hopefully your streams have been going well lately. Well, let me know what you've been up to on your stream, my good friend. If you don't take proper care of your equipment, it can fail you when you really need it. Good lad, good lad. Always take care of your equipment, ladies and gentlemen. Right, what else do we have around here? Pretty damn. Yeah, you get a lot of good life tips from Pokemon. I'll tell you that for nothing. 
Sorry, but Team Yell caused quite the kerfuffle, and now the bridge is in a bit of a state. We'll have things cleared. Uh, we'll have things cleaned quick as can be done. But could you give us some time? No, no, I will not. I'm gonna go swim instead. What's this? Something carved into the stone. It says fire. Cool. Uh, can I fish? No. Okay. Uh, they have gone well. Destiny 2, Planet Zoo, and Jackbox lately. Ooh, nice, nice. Yeah, I watched Marty Ray, um, Marty, of course, play um, Planet Zoo, and it looks really interesting, actually. Hopefully you're having a lot of fun with it. You still, you're on that Destiny 2 grind as well, are you? Very cool, very cool. Uh, it said three stones, right? Is this the treasure down here? Uh... Max Revive? I mean, not much of a treasure, but it'll do. <laughs> With grass in front. Yeah, would you call that grass in front? It looks fab. Still many bugs though on Planet Zoo. Really? Ah, oh, that's annoying. Hopefully nothing too game-breaking. Something like that. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Oh, grass. Um, oh, they all say grass. I didn't take notes because it was a lot of words. It was a lot of words, and it kept repeating the same word over and over again. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the little gust flare. Lovely. How you doing, love? Milo does more than just work the fields. He raises beautiful flowers, too. Lovely. If you hold flowers, Pokemon will gather around you. Lovely. Strength. It said that a lot. It said a lot of strength, didn't it? Yeah. It just kept saying strength all, all the time. Dark. All right. So each of these stones represents a different Pokemon type. Interesting. Take a look at this, Dan. The Grass Gym Badge. I got it in one try. You already have it? Oh my god. I reckon I'm just about the greatest when it comes to wrangling. Woo! I've had plenty of practice at it, after all. But I'm sure you can win this one, too. After all, you are my rival. And away he goes. Show off. I know, right? What a show off. He's like, yo, I got it already, you nerd. I'm going to crush his dreams and steal his money. <laughs> All right, lad. Uh, you can challenge gyms as many times as you want. I guess it's just the, I guess it's to test your unbreakable will. Yeah. The lead card of gym leaders tells all sorts of stories. Well, yeah, let's take a look at the lead card. So we collect these cards from uh, different people. Here's mine. Mine looks amazing, by the way. Uh, yes, I know. Uh, but we also have Leon's, which looks amazing. Uh, but this is Milo's. Very cool. I like that. He's an 831 kind of guy. And there's your boy hop. Yeah, it does. Mine looks the best, right? Yeah. <laughs> if only mine was an actual dab. <laughs> Very cool. Very cool. All right. Let's head on in. Add my card. How do I do it, Exo? Can you tell me? I want to see your card. How do we do it? How do we do it? Can you show me? Can you show me the way? Teach me how to do it, man. I don't know how to do it. Oh, swap cards. Uh, start trading. Let's trade some lead cards. Okay. Oh, wait, no. Oh, code. Right. Uh, swap cards. Uh, okay. Yes. In that screen before. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, set link code. Uh, you can be sure to get with one another. Okay. All right, we're doing it. So, uh... Zero, 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 zero. Uh, oh, we, oh, that's a four-digit one. Oh, I'm doing it wrong. I'm doing it wrong. Um, all right. Can you teach me from the very start? <laughs> what do I press? I want to do it. Uh, I don't know how to do it. Actually, make a room code. It's fine, too. All right, okay. Oh, no, no, don't link battle. Okay, swap code. No, don't start trading. No, don't do that. I keep pressing the wrong buttons. I'm so sorry. I'm so bad at this. I'm so confused. If we use the same four-digit number, it'll put us together. All right, okay. Give me a second. Let me just, uh, let me just uh, get my brain back in gear. Focus DJ and all that. All right. The code is... 2850... Focus down, focus. Consider me focused. 
2850. There we go. All right, 2850. So far behind from buffering and lag. Ah, I'm sorry, dude. I'm sorry. But yes, 2850. Oh, there we go. Do we get it? All right, I'm searching. Hopefully we get it. Hopefully we get it. It says you up there. Have you traded your car card? Is that you? Did we do it? Uh, how have we done it? Did we do it? I'm so confused. Oh, here we go. All right, here we are. Uh, that one, right? Isn't that you? That's you, right? Isn't it? Uh, did we do it? I don't know if we did it. <laughs> I'm so confused. <laughs> this game is so OP. Too OP for me. Let me know how it's going over there, bud. I'm going to talk to some people. Hey, kid. I just can't seem to catch a Galarian Meowth. If you've got a Galarian Meowth, want to trade it for my Meowth? Um, I do have a Galarian Meowth. Uh, but no. Because I've already got a regular Meowth. Um, as am I. Yeah, I'm pretty confused, too. <laughs> Uh, uh, load new. I thought I saw you. Um, like, no. Uh, okay. All right, we'll figure it out. Don't you worry. Uh, friends only. Ah, right, okay. Alright, we'll figure it out, man. Don't you worry. We'll figure it out sometime. Oh, wait. Uh, no. Alright, we'll figure it out sometime. Either way, let's go buy some stuff. Alright. When you're looking at the gym trainer's cards, you can put... Oh, can you? Alright, okay. Let me, uh, let me buy stuff first. Uh, potions. Apologies for this, guys, but I really want some cards. <laughs> I like card games. <laughs> All right, okay, so, um, not that one. I keep going to the wrong one. Lead card. Uh, card code. Receive a card. Brilliant. All right, here we go. We did it, guys. Hope you guys can make it work. Yeah, I think we got it. I think we got it. All right, so, zero, 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 six, uh, wings without the eye. Sorry, uh, and a five, sorry. Um, and then seven L. Is that it? Did I do it? Did I win? Uh, no, I, that's... Nope. God damn it. Uh, seven L. Don't be dumb, DJ. You can do it. Okay, get it. And there is my code. Wait, have you posted yours as well, man? Where have you posted it? All right, there you go. So this is Exos. Oh... Exo, why not? What a beautiful boy you are. Look at you. What a beautiful boy. You're a proper beautiful boy you are, lad. Very good. Um, curry decks, zero kinds of curry. Rally best score, Pokemon Court. No shinies found yet. And you got Sobble and Eevee. Ah, I can't even recognize those two. Very cool. Are so good. I know, right? Very cool. Thanks for that, man. Appreciate it. Let's get Mr. Ray's as well. All right, let's see what Mr. Ray looks like. Yeah, friggin' Exos looks good. All right, so you're a 0007, uh, 4H, G, 9, X, and Y. All right, let's see what Mr. Ray looks like. Here we go. Mr. Ray? Uh, have I done it right? Did he get yours too? I imagine so. Ah, uh, oh, there you go. Nice simple one. A nice simple one from Mr. Rare. Lovely. Good old Rare Corner. Beautiful. Let me know if you guys get mine as well. I assume you do, right? Uh, oh, there you go. He's nice and new. He's a new boy. He's a new BR Rare Corner. Very good. I has cards. Yay. I love it. I love it. That's so good. I want everyone's cards now. Press share code. Uh, okay, sharing your card, doing it, 
your card is now shared. Uh, you can give out your cards by sharing your card code. All right, there you go. Do you guys need to type that one down? Type what? Type that one down. Or post it in chat. If someone can post that in chat, that'd be awesome. Uh, I suppose I can do it. Unless someone else is going to get it. Race to see who can type faster. Uh, ah, yep. Yeah, access to OP. Cheers, cheers, bro. You OP. OP, man. OP, OP. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> uh, cheers KMS as well. Thanks guys, appreciate it. Appreciate it. I'm slow. I mean, I'm even slower, so don't worry. <laughs> Welcome to the uniform shop. Are you looking for anything in particular? Oh, we can get a new uniform. Oh. 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 Oh, we have to have one of these. Oh, what do you reckon? So expensive, I know. Oh. Oh, it's a steel one, right? Oh, I want to be a steel boy. Oh, we can't even afford it. Oh, that's so disappointing. Ah, I want it though. Is there anything? Oh, no, we have a nugget. We're buying it. I'm sorry, guys. I'm, I'm, it's probably such a dumb purchase, but I'm doing it. Uh... Where the nuggets get sold? There we go. There we go. Cheers, bro. Preach. All right, let's get let's get fancy. So this is our gym battle uh, clove clothing. So yeah, I'm I'm friggin' Iron Boy right now. Let's do it. Or Steel Boy. <laughs> Spend all your money on clothes? Yeah, you bet your ass I'm gonna do that. Oh man. All right. Okay. Cool. All right. All right. Time for our first gym battle. Maybe. Let's see what happens. Welcome, Gym Challenger. Allow me to help you through your registration. First things first, how about a quick refresher about the Gym Challenge? Your goal as a Gym Challenger is to complete each Gym Mission, defeat every Gym Leader, and gather eight Gym Badges. Uh, Gym Missions? The Gym Mission is a sort of test you need to go through before facing the Gym Leader. Each Gym has a different mission for challenges. So would you like to attempt the Gym Mission? Yeah, there's missions now. I was very curious about these. All right, let's do it. If you'd like to attempt the gym mission, please change into your uniform. Ah, oh, here we go. Steel boy. Then let the gym mission begin. Give it your best shot. Here we go. Good old 769. Let's do it. Let's be gym heroes. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh, it's so big. Oh, it's so big. Why is it so big? I gotta go pick up my BF from work, so I'm off now, guys. Ah, oh, have a good night, SP. Have a good night. Drive safe and all that. See you next time, fella. Enjoy the rest of your street. Yeah, we will, man. Have a good night. See you next time, man. See you next time, bud. Thanks for dropping by. The mission given by Tuffield Pokemon Gym is this. To chase our unruly Wulu. Oh wow, okay. To that blockade we've made from our bales of straw over there. Wow. Oh, uh, by the way, you can call me down. <laughs> I serve as a referee, and it's also my job to report the result of battle to the League HQ. The one the hop got first try. Yeah, exactly. That's what he meant by wrangling Wooloo. Yeah. Now let the gym mission begin. All right, okay. Uh... Oh, look at me go! Rolling, rolling, rolling. Keep those doggies rolling. Go hard. There we go. We're doing it. This is actually not that bad. It's actually not that bad. Wooly ball. Yeah. Minecraft has preferred you for this. Yeah. I'm, ve I'm very good at wrangling me some Wooly. Oh, there's a Yampers in the field. Oh, straight through, boys. Straight through. Kind of, maybe. Oh, wait, okay, 19. Oh, oh, we got a unruly one. We did it, there you go. Oh, I love this, this is so cool. <laughs> Smack! All right, okay, what about you, fella? You want me to challenge you? Let's do it. Welcome to the gym. Well, sorry, welcome, gym challenger. Sorry, but I'll have to send you packing. It's my job. 
we shouldn't have a problem with this gym at all because we have a fire type Pokemon. So we're going to fly through this. TJ Best Shepherd, that's me, man. That's me. <laughs> oh, man. I mean, I could have used my Yamper as well. Such a good, such a good boy. All right, let's, uh, it's Gossifler. So electric type moves will not do much damage to it. So let's just clobber it around with Tackle for a wee bit. Critical hit, that's worrying. Oh man, so Gossy Flair knows Rapid Spin as well. Very good. All right, let's keep tackling it. I can't wait to actually get to the gym battle. That's going to be cool. Oh, Leafage. Ooh, okay. Cool. Not seen that attack, I don't think. I don't think I've seen Leafage before. All right, let's smack it around a wee bit more. Let's Rapid Spin a wee bit. There we go. And then one more tackle, maybe. Um, oh, no, just a leafage, and I love the way he wiggles his butt before he charges in. That's so adorable. My god, I love it. All right, Yampa almost with a level up. Tootle and Nickit got a level up, though, so very good indeed. Uh, oh, looks like Nickit's a special attacker. Curious. As expected, a gym lead, a gym challenger, and their Pokemon are in perfect sync with each, with each other. There you go. I can't read today, guys. Sorry. <laughs> oh, Nickit's evolving! It's happening! We're evolving, Nickit! Let's do it! Yeah, so one, again, one of the very first Pokemon we caught evolves into that majestic beast. Nickit evolves into Feeble. Oh, nice. Ah, oh, look at the little mustache. Ah, oh, very cool. Nice, I like it. I like it. Let's learn a little more about Feeble. Feeble, the fox Pokemon. It secretly marks potential targets with a scent. By following the scent, it stalks its targets and steals uh, from them when they least expect it. Because of Nickit, yeah, like steal. Yeah, like stealing things. Very good. I like that. Uh, Feeble wants to learn the move Thief. Of course you do. Um, <laughs> let's teach you the move Thief. Uh, do we want it, actually? Oh, no, Thief's good in this generation, isn't it? Uh, okay, let's give it for assurance. That's really cool. I'm so glad we got to see uh, Nickit uh, evolve. Very cool. I like it. I like it. He, it looks so dastardly. I love it. Um... How do I use the uh, the box link? Is it in here? No. Uh, the box link thing. I don't know how to use it. It was in there, was it? Uh, ah, yes. I'm blind. Can't use it. You can't use your Pokemon boxes from your bag. How do I do it, though? Do I do it from here? Is this how I do it? Uh, swap Pokemon? Uh, hmm. I'm learning! <laughs> I missed it completely, didn't I? Uh, hmm. No. I don't have to use it. I might be dumb. Yeah, I might be dumb. Okay, we'll learn how to use it. We'll learn how to use it, I'm sure. All right, come with me, Rulu. Ah, <laughs> so the Yampers, uh, they act like uh, kind of like uh, sheep dog in a sheep dogs in a way. They can kind of like separate them a little bit. Too clever, too clever for us. All right, so let's do that up there. Bad Yampers, stop, stop hampering me right now. I need to get through this. Uh. Come here, bloody Wooloos. No, Wooloo, what are you doing? Wooloo, there we go. Okay. Wooloo, Wooloo. All right, we're gonna take him up here. I know there's a battle here, but we'll take him up here. I wonder if your Pokemon want to use their moves with all the strength and feel great. I hope so too. I hope they want to feel great when they destroy you, Mark. Oh, hey, Mark. Oh, look how happy he is. Oh, he won't be in a second. <laughs> All right, go get him, Yampa. Go get him. All right, Yampa, use a uh, tackle. Might got the ball cut. Yeah, feels bad, man. 
That's all right, though. That's all right. He's rocking it well. He's, he's a good lad, on Mark. He's a good lad. I'm still going to destroy him now. <laughs> all right. So, uh, Nickit. What level was Nickit? Level 16, I think? Can't quite remember now. Um... When does Yamfer evolve, I wonder? Don't tell me if you know, or if he actually evolves at all. If he doesn't evolve, don't tell me that either. And does he evolve using a Thunderstone? I wonder. That's the big question. That's the big mystery of this game. All right, there we go. Level 20. Is that an evolution level? Yamfer wants to learn Spark. Yes. All right, uh, Spark, let's see. Spark is so much better than Nuzzle. Oh, so good. Um, we are going to get rid of Tail Whip. We'll keep Nuzzle because it is very good at applying Paralysis, even though Spark is able to do the same thing, but Nuzzle has got a much better chance. I know nothing. Don't worry. I know nothing as well. <laughs> All right, and now well, we have Oddis. Beautiful. So we have a much stronger Electric-type move now, which is awesome. Um... I wonder if that makes Spark technically stronger. No, no, probably not, actually. Oh, no, what was Spark? 65? Uh, I think that's 90. That's 45. It's uh, comparable, I'd say. I like Oddish. Yeah, Oddish is cool. You may remember Oddish from uh, Pokemon Let's Go uh, Pikachu uh, as well. Oh, there you go. There's that paralysis that we needed. Yeah, dude, yeah. Evolves into Gloom. Good old Gloom, eh? Good old Gloom. Always drinking too much. All right, we need to heal, like, right now. And we don't have much in the way of... Oh, no, no, oh, no we bought a bunch of potions. Brilliant. I'm so glad we bought a bunch of potions. <laughs> I like Odyssey better than Gloom. Yeah, Odyssey is nice and simple and cute, right? I like that. I like it. It's cool. All right, now... Can we defeat Oddish here with a couple of sparks? Let's do it. Such a good boy. Such a good boy. Go get him. Oh, God. This is going to be a long fight. That's fine, though. That's fine. Such a good waggle butt. All right. Gorgeous boy. Gorgeous boy. If we get us fully paralyzed hits there, we should be okay. We should be all right. One more hit. One more hit. That'll be fine. All right, good. We're doing fine, ladies and gentlemen. We are doing fine. And... Spark. Beautiful. All right, Oddish is down. That was quite a fight. You're doing amazing. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Appreciate that. I'll give a bow walk instead of Yamper. Aw, oh, cheers for your bow walk, Mark. Bow walk, Mark. Nice. All right, let's get the rest of these Wooloos into the pens. There we go. And 20. And boop. Beautiful, beautiful. Boot the heck out of those hay bales. We did it. Yeah, just one more challenge here. All right. Okay, we'll take these through. We'll take these lot through. All right, here we go. All right, I don't know where the others have gone. I'm hoping the others are okay. There you go. All right, let's look, let's look at like 17. All right, we got 17 Wooloos. 17 Wooloos have made it to the pen. Very good. All right, let us heal a wee bit. Let's use a fresh water, which will revive us for 30 health, I believe. Yeah, there we go. All right. We did it. We're doing it. All right, lady. How you doing? The gym leader lies just ahead of you, but that doesn't mean you'll be reaching him. That's what you think. I'm going to friggin' trounce on your dreams, sir. Yeah, going to kick your ass, man. Bon Sweet. Ah, this is one of the Pokemon Exo has. Very cool. Very cool. All right. Well, uh, let's friggin' spark you to death. Bro. Let's do it. So yeah, the interesting thing here is that Spark is not very effective. However, when you compare it to the damage from our weaker move, Tackle, um, it's actually just as good, in my opinion. So it's all good. 
It, it, it's good enough anyway. And plus we get that extra paralysis chance just like that. Looks like a radish. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? Looks adorable. Looks adorable. I like it a lot. Alright, uh, rapid spin again. Everything seems to know rapid spin. That's pretty cool. I like that it's a common move now. It, it probably means that, I don't know, entry hazards won't be a thing, because everything can learn it. <laughs> Alright. There you go. Another level for reboot there, maybe? Ooh, no, not quite. Not quite. Alright, and we've got an Oddish. I think we'll try and speed this up a bit, so let's get Reboot into the action. I think Reboot could do with a level or two, so uh, let's get Reboot in. Remember how we're doing this. Yamper and Reboot are the only Pokémon on our official team right now. We've brought the others along with us just so we can see evolutions, because everything gets experience when you, uh, when you battle in this game. So, uh, yeah, that's how we're playing it. If we see something we like, like really like, that we want in the team, it will be a permanent part of the team for sure. There you go. Good job, Reboot. Good job. Next is the gym leader, right? What a strong challenger. Oh, I'm the best challenger. I'm friggin' king of challenges. Don't mess with me and your friggin' corgis of doom. All right, where have you put me, we lose? Where have you put me, we lose? There you are. All right, come on, you buggers. Aye, I'm dabbing on all those friggin' battlers, aren't I? Dabbing on all those battlers. Whistling on all of them as well. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. Let's do it. Yeah, prison compatible with Thunderstone. Ah, really? Okay, cool. That's fine. Alright, so it's so if it does evolve, it's a level of evolution. Okay, cool. Fair enough, man. Fair enough. Alright, the Wooloos have parted. Just like everyone's favorite Bible story, the parting of the Wooloos. There you go. Okay. Looks like they're all in the pens. Jobs are good. Right. So, is it time? Is it time for Milo? Oh, man. Those gardens. I know, right? Aren't they pretty? Super pretty. Meh. God damn it. All right, let's go, boys. Let's do it. So many steps. The gym challenge has been completed. Gym mission cleared. Aw. Oh. oh, my little Dan's growing up. Woo! Oh. Oh. I'm too scared. No, I'm ready. Oh. Nope, too net. No, I'm kidding. Yeah. Let's just sneak out. Let's just sneak out. Like, just peek a little bit. Oh, no. Okay, cutscene got us. Here we go. The next challenge, yeah. Ah. Oh. All right, big fella. How you doing? Oh, man. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited to lose to this fella. <laughs> Ball holster. I know, right? Look how cool he looks. My gym's the first one people face, so we get a lot of challenges. That's why I tried to keep the gym mission challenging, but that didn't stop you from completing it, Dan. Proper job. Sure seems like you understand Pokemon real well. This is going to be a doozy of a battle. I'll have to Dynamax my Pokemon if I want to win. Oh, God, wait, you can Dynamax them? I can't do that. Well, I can, but only with certain Pokemon. Uh-oh. Right? I don't know. Let's see how it goes. You are challenged by Jim Lee the Milo! Let the battle begin! That's cheating? Ah, oh, it's fine, don't worry, we'll crush him anyway. So swag, he is a swag boy for sure. Oh, hello! Oh! The Dynamax Phenomenon. In the Galar region, Pokemon can become far larger than usual in certain places. This transformation is called Dynamaxing. Press the Dynamax button when your Dynamax band lights up to Dynamax your Pokemon. Your Pokemon can only Dynamax for three turns. During that time, your Dynamax Pokemon can use extremely powerful moves known as Max Moves. These Max Moves not only deal tremendous damage, they can also trigger special effects. The exact effect changes depending on what type of move was used. Choose carefully when to Dynamax your Pokemon and smash your way to victory. 
We're going to Dynamax Yampa. Not yet, but it's going to happen. All right. Okay. Gossifleur. What we're going to do for you then? Um, all right. Let's see if we can get some paralysis going on. All right. Rapid spin. That's perfectly fine. Do not mind that at all. Okay. So we get to Dynamax, but we're only going to do it when he does it, I think. I think that's when we're going to do it. Rounds won't be too strong. No, rounds not a very strong move. Not used on its own like that anyway. All right. Let's spark our way through Gossifler. Let's do it. Smash. All right, feels good. And a couple more sparks will do the job. Oh, Magic Leaf. This will probably be the strongest move that's, that gets used, and it certainly is, so I'm going to heal a bit. I'm going to heal a bit. I always feel a bit cheesy when I heal in a battle, but that's fine. Oh, oh man. I can't wait to see Gossip fly so big. <laughs> go, go, boy. <laughs> that's the closest thing we have to a Yampa remote. There you go. <laughs> uh, all right. Almost there. Rapid spin again. That's fine. All right. Uh, we really want to crit here. I mean, it is a corgi. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. <laughs> uh, all right. Potion and Yampa. And let's go. Big old heal. All right. And one more round. We should be okay. 38 down to 29. Nice and easy. All right, Gossip Flare is down. All right, so he hasn't chosen to uh, uh, Dynamax his Gossip Flare here. That's interesting. Not too bothered about that. I wonder what he will grow. There you go. Good boy, Yampa. Good boy. All right, Elder Goss. I don't know what an Elder Goss is. Woohoo! <laughs> We're not going to be done in that easy. We're tough as weeds. Yeah. What's an Elder Goss? Ooh, it's got like a big afro. Very cool. All right, I'm going to heal again. I can hear the crowd in the background. Very cool. All right, let's uh, heal up a wee bit. What's this? Oh, here we go. Come on, then. It's Dynamax time. You're about to be uprooted. Uh-oh. Oh, Yampa. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, Elder Goss. He has freckles instead of a nose. Yeah. And a giant-ass diva. Oh, my God. Uh... This will really leave you in shock and awe. It's our Dynamax move. Oh, Yampa, please. Ah! <laughs> ah! Grass grew, covered the battlefield. Yampa just got annihilated. <laughs> oh my god! All right, reboot. All right, reboot. All right. We got this. Time for some friggin' bun food right now. Let's do it. We're gonna use maximum flare. It's a grass type, so let's use fire. Yeah, you flip those tables. Come back here, reboot. You're getting supersized. All right. Behold, Dynamax reboot. Big old ninja bunny. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, you bet this battle's on right now. Giant ninja bunny to the rescue. Maximum flare! Nice. Good shot, bud. Good shot. Right there. All right, the sunlight turned harsh. Eldergrass uses maximum strike. Pog? I know, right? So cool. It's like friggin' Godzilla, man. Oh, you think that speed drop's gonna stop me from murdering your ass right now? Alright. Bunzilla. Friggin' Bunzilla is gonna friggin' maximum flare right now. Let's do it. Smash! 
And there goes Eldegoss. Eldegoss is destroyed. Take that, Eldegoss, you nerd. Bunzilla, OP, OP. Oh, Yampa. Sorry you missed out on that experience, bud. Poor guy. Nice. Yeah, we did good. We did good. Yampa will get its time to uh, Dynamax for sure. Yeah, you got wrecked, fella. The power of the grass is well. Uh, what an incredible challenger. And we got some money. Noise. And the crowd go wild. They chant my name. Hopefully. That must have been a fulfilling Pokemon battle for you. As proof that you have defeated the gym leader for the gym challenge, I'm going to give you 200 bits. Oh, thank you, KMS, for the 200 bits. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. You're the best. Allow me to present you with your very own grass badge. Aw. Oh, yeah, there you go. We, we English folk, we do like a lovely bit of sportsmanship. That's us. You can now catch Pokemon of up to level 25. You need to obtain all eight gym badges in order to compete, uh, complete the gym challenge. The only way to gather the badges is to defeat every gym leader. We did it. There you go. Chall Challenger Dan, my most sincere congratulations on defeating gym leader Milo. Please accept this TM to commemorate your victory. And we received TM10, Magical Leaf. Uh, just a very bog-standard uh, grass-type move. Very nice to have it, there. There we go. It also never misses, actually. There you go. Here, you can have Milo's uniform to go with it. It's a replica, of course. And there you go. We get Milo's clothes as well. Oh, nice. Yeah, we get to dress like this big boy now. Some advice for you, Dan. The gym challenge has a set order you'll need to follow. Master has given Tuffy a <laughs> Very good. Very good. That Harry Potter reference right there. <laughs> so that means your next stop should be in Hullbury to meet Nessa. Hullbury is just beyond Route 5. Or since you've got the grass badge, you could head to the wild area. It's a bit tricky to catch Pokemon that are a higher level than the Pokemon on your team, but they make powerful allies if you succeed. There you go. I know you don't know Harry Potter. I don't know, but I I know um I know I know Dobby. I know Dobby, that's for sure. Um He's like the the house guy, right? The little house elf thing, right? Oh, what do you think of me, Pokeball Man? Hey there! Thanks for rolling by to have a chat with your mate, the ball guy. As a sign of our friendship, let me give you a wonderful Pokeball. Oh, a friend ball. Oh, it's always good to trade balls with your friends. Yep. Yeah, okay, I got it. I got it. I know my Harry Potter, man. If you catch a Pokemon with a friend ball, it'll become friendly in no time. Just like uh, how we became friends. Pokeballs are just full of surprises, don't you think? Yeah, he balling, man. He friggin' balling. Balling out of control. Oh, look at the blip bug down here. Milo lost one match. Who's talking about me? What about you, ladies? That trainer, he could be a surprise success. Yeah, you bet your ass I'm a surprise success. He's not a bad trainer, I guess. I'm friggin' better than you think. What about you? How you doing, love? But having his chase around Wulu, Milo's not as nice as he looks. <laughs> Lovely bit of exercise there. We did it! We got a gym badge! Woo! Yeah! We did it! Feels good, man. Feels good. What are people saying here? Ooh, people have been finding Pokemon. Very cool, very cool. Uh, I can't believe Milo lost. We did it, yeah, they're all talking about us. We're world famous now. We're world famous, are you talking about us? Route five is really long. It feels good to speed through it though. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. So I'm gonna imagine this is route five over here. Do we want the Standing Stone treasure? We kinda do, don't we? Let's go talk to that little girl again. And then let's say strength like 5,000 times. What should actually be like nothing or something I've already picked up? <laughs> all right, all right, kid. A treasure lies buried somewhere in Turffield. According to this treasure map, the trick to finding the treasure lies in the Standing Stones. Seek yourself free Standing Stones with grass before the others. Okay. Use well that strength and find then the strength 
all of its strength in the end. <gasps> I think I know what it means. Tell not if you've a mind to find what time has left behind. Okay, okay. To move that annoying button left thing, press Y, swap cards, quiz cancel. Yeah, I'll do that in a second. I was just, I was just thinking of doing that. <laughs> Sorry about that. We found the three grass stones. Yeah, yeah. So, going to the treasure map. Check is the sand stone. Seek yourself the three standing stones uh, with grass before the other ones. Use well that strength. Okay. So, grass type Pokemon are strong against water. So use well that strength would be, you know, if you use your grass strength well, you're using it against water, perhaps. And find then the strength of its strength in the end. So that would mean that grass is weak to fire. So then we need to look at the fire one. Or maybe it means the strength of water. Well, it's already, we've already found the strength of water. I reckon we go grass, fire, water. So having your... Close tag on. Wasn't sure if you knew. No, don't worry. I see it. I see it. <laughs> don't worry, lad. All right. Okay. All right. All right. Um, I'm gonna check these stones. I can do this. All right. So we already know the grass one is the free one. Let's find the fire one and the water one, and then let's see if we can kind of figure this out. So what do we have here? So you are dark. Okay. So we don't want the dark one. Uh, yeah, let me remove it now. Um, slot cards. Um, yes. There we go. Alright, sweet. Cheers for the tip. Cheers for the tip, my good friend! Right, okay. I want this treasure. I want this treasure, man. I want this treasure. This is probably completely wrong, by the way, but I really want it. Alright, so. Fire and water. I reckon that's it. I reckon that's totally it. What do we have up here? So this is water. Okay. Um, what's fire? I bet fire is one of them. And this is flying. Uh, could be relevant. Poison. Are there any more around? Hmm. Okay. So according to this treasure map, the trick is to find the standing stones. Seek yourself free standing stones with grass before the other ones. Use well that strength. So that would be the water one. And find then the strength of its strength in the end. Flying. Maybe they're all in groups of three. Or oh, maybe. I don't know. Was water three stones? No, it, I don't think it was. I think it's just. Oh, I think. Oh, it might have been the one we just checked. I'll need to check again. Find the strength of its strength in the end. That is not if you've a mind to find what time is left behind. All right. Okay. Uh, let's check. Oh, it isn't free. Oh, well done. Uh, so this is a free one as well. Okay. Um, and this is flying and poison, and there was dark down there. Is there a fire one? Am I overthinking this? Let's look for another group of three. Yeah, I can't seem to find one there. None that I can get to. I can't get to that one. Oh, there's one over here. Oh, what are you? Were you fire? Ah, okay, right. Okay, all right. Grass, water, fire. That's what I'm going to go for. But what are you? Oh, we found a Neverstone. Oh, cool. Nice. Uh, nice. Um, oh, there's something down here as well. Ooh, TM. Or TR. Oh, brutal swing. Ooh, what's that? Okay, I think I got it. I think I got it. Uh, the user swings its body around violently to inflict damage on everything in its vicinity. Ah, very cool. Very cool. Uh, right, okay. Right, you ready for this? I'm going to do it. I'm gonna do it. Okay, so. <sighs> okay, so. You gotta start at the grass one. Uh, which is down here, I believe. Unless I've completely missed it. No. So you start at the grass one. Okay. Then you use the strength well. 
And I think the only one that grass is strong against that we've seen is water. So water is over here. Uh, yeah. And then use the strength of the strength. So is that fire versus grass? Because I don't think anything we've found challenges water. So this should be it. Do it. I believe in you. Oh, let's see if that belief is in... Uh, is good. Oh. Oh, here we go. There's something buried in the ground. Yeah! We got an expert belt. We did it. You did it. God, I'm so clever. <laughs> I'm so clever. Oh, man. So an item to be held by a Pokemon. If it's well-worn... It's a well-worn belt that's slightly... Boost the power of super effective moves. Yeah, there you go. Expert belt is good. Nice. Cheers, Kurgan. Intelligence 100. Thanks, XO. <laughs> DJ so smart. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> Expert belts are really, really good. They raise the power of super effective hits, which is really awesome, actually. Oh, oh, hi. Oh, God. Do we have reporters in this game? Oh, I love it. Say hello to the BBC. Time for a special interview with a gym challenger. The best way to get to know you is a Pokemon battle, of course. Good Pokemon, Trent. Good Pokemon and Trent is really shine on camera. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. So we had um, reporters in, um, in Gen 3 with Pokemon and Sapphire. Uh, we get a bunch of Gen 5s as well. So we get Helioptile, and we get Clink as well. Very cool. Clink is a Steel-type Pokemon. Helioptile is an Electric-type Pokemon. Uh, right, so... Uh, Clink will want to be Sparked, and... Um, we'll Flame Charge the Clink as well. Interesting. Yeah, yeah. There you go. So Clink... Just a nice normal steel one. There you go. And uh, yeah, Helioptile will get smashed as well. Woo! We did it! I feel so clever. <laughs> All right, Tuple got a level. Very good. Helioptile will use Mud Slap to get a bit of super effective damage there, but uh, we should be okay. I, I mean, Scam uh, Yampa's got Spark here, which won't do a whole turn because it is an electric type itself. You are so clever. Oh, thank you. <laughs> I'm, glad, I'm glad I was able to do that. That's really neat. The way they pulled aspects of previous games together has been done well. Yeah, I think it's neat, isn't it? I think it's real neat. We've seen like a good mix, haven't we? Um, I'm ha always happy to see a good mix, for sure. Oh, we need to, um, we need to put Feeble in our box. I think, and Dottler as well. I don't know if Dotler will evolve again. It might do, but we should evolve some other Pokemon, so we should go back to our box and see what we've got. It's hard to describe it in just a few words. What incredible potential. Uh, I lost. Does that mean interviews are ruined? Ah, it was. You're a terrible lad. We're going to shoot it again. Alright, okay. Okay, we're going to go back to the Pokemon Center, and we're going to trade out a few Pokemon. Because I want to see other Pokemon evolve. So, yeah, we'll put Feeble away. Will Dottler evolve again? Look how pretty it is. I know, right? Such a beautiful landscape. I love it. It's so good. Oh, Lotto ID? I'm now connected to the servers at the Lotto ID Center. We'll draw a number, and if it's a match for the ID number of any of your Pokemon, you could win a fabulous prize. Ready to save your progress and try your luck? Servers. Yeah. <laughs> then here we go. Best of luck. Here's your number. The Gen 2 ID lot. Oh, yeah, exactly. We could win a Master Ball here. Let's see if it matches any Pokemon's ID number. Replic, you didn't get a match. You suck. All right, okay. Fair enough. All right. So, yeah, we, could, we can do that a bunch. Poker jobs? What's a poker job? Oh god, have they made like a little meta game? Um, Pokemon are in high demand as helpers. 
um, in the Galar region, and you're able to send your Pokemon out to help out on jobs. The Pokemon you send out will grow stronger from the experience they gain. The job postings will be updated every day. Good things will begin to happen if you send lots of Pokemon to many jobs. So keep an eye out for new postings. Ah, cool. It's WoW Garrisons, is that how it works? Yeah. Dispatch Pokemon to do quests? Yeah. No, I've seen, um, I've seen this kind of thing in quite a few games, actually. That's really cool. Alright, so nobody can deny that grass-type Pokemon are the best at handling plants. We'll be overjoyed if some could help us out. Um, do we have any grass-type? Good to use box Pokemon to do stuff. Yeah, isn't that cool? And catch a lot? Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Alright, uh, Gossifleur. Go get them. Um, who else would be good? They may as well learn their keep. Exactly, man. Exactly. Uh, Mudbray, you're not a grass type, but you'll do well. Uh, what about... We need someone to, like, watch over them, so we'll use Woobat. And then, uh, we'll send this cold-hearted killer as well. Go get a Meowth. Your Pokemon will be sent to the job site. <laughs> Is that okay? Sure. Choose how long you want your Pokemon to help out. Uh... Whole day. Cold-hearted killer. He basically is, that Meowth. Cold hearted killer. There you go. I just found my kids, their first jobs. Very good. Donkey boy. I love him. I know, right? Well, he's, he's working now. He's a working boy. <laughs> We're looking for normal type Pokemon. Together we can make cloth that you can use in any way you like. All right, let's do it. All right, so you want normal type Pokemon? You bet your ass I've got some normal type Pokemon. All right. Take my meow for a wee bit. Uh, take my Zigzagoon. Oh, they're saying that you're dark, aren't you? You're dark now, right? I think so. Alright, fine. Take any. Uh, take... Take my roly Coley. There you go. Your Pokemon will be sent to the job site. And they can be gone for the whole day, too. We did it! I love him. Yeah. He's a cool guy on Mudbray. Mudbray's cool. Alright, sweet. Away they go. Amazing. <laughs> oh, go make daddy some money. I, I, need to, I, need, I got some bills to pay. Got mouths to feed. God damn it. <laughs> uh, Alright, so I'd like to see something else evolve. Alright. So I have a feeling that... Um... Actually, uh, the only one we can really do is Ricky D. So let's move Ricky D in place of Feeble. I actually don't have any other new Pokemon available because I've just sent them all out. <laughs> these are all um, these are all uh, uh, older gens, or I've already got it, like Tootle. So yeah, whoops. That's fine. That's fine. Nothing to worry about with that. All right, let's head to Route 5, shall we? And uh, let's keep going, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> That's all right. They're earning a living. That's fine. Nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that at all. All right, what have we got around here then? Ooh. Oh, oh. what have we got here? Oh, a little on the slavery is good for them. Exactly. Yeah. All right, we got Esper here. I remember you. Esper, I believe, is a psychic type Pokemon. Little, uh, little sad ghosty guy. Not a new Pokemon, but that's absolutely fine. We don't mind. Uh, we don't mind the older gens. So uh, let's give this one a wee bit of a crunch. There you go. Should be good for a two-hit KO. We're gonna catch some more Pokemon. New to me? Yeah, it's a psychic type, I believe. Uh, I remember one of the anime episodes having Esper in it. Very cute. I like it. It also has a different... I think it, I think it can evolve into two different types of Pokemon. Or two different versions. Like a male, female. I can't quite remember, though. Um, oh, I was supposed to catch it, not kill it. God damn it. You killed it, though. I know, I forgot... <laughs> <laughs> I forgot. Ah, <laughs> oh, goddamn it! All right, 
So uh, this one is uh, an old one as well. This is Stuffle, the pre-evolved form of Beware, which is one of the Pokemon that you saw in the wild area. I don't know if you guys remember the big pink thing that you saw in the wild area, but this is the pre-evolved form. What are you? I love it. Oh, this is Stuffle. Yeah, he's like a stuffed toy. He's gorgeous. He's gorgeous. He evolves into the silliest looking Pokemon, but I adore it. I really do. Alright, Stuffle. In you go, fella. In you go. Is a cutie. Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad you love it. Love me some Stuffle. There you go. Guys, that was a Stuffle. Yeah, it's basically just like a stuffed bear, basically. It's cute, and I love it. It's amazing. Alright, let's have a look. Stuffle, the flailing Pokemon. Its fluffy fur is a delight to pet, but carelessly reaching out to touch this Pokemon can result in painful retaliation. Yeah, so it evolves into like a big kind of crazy bear looking thing called Beware. So that's the danger that it's warning you about. No touchy. Quite right. <laughs> All right. I spy a Minchino. Here we go. Minchino. Very cool Pokemon. Like me some Minchino right here. So let's give it a spark. Oh, I know, right? Minchino, again, not a new Pokemon, but that's absolutely fine. Minchino's a cutie. Let's go for a big spark. Paralyze would be nice. No? Alright. Alright, we'll try we'll catch this one. Try and catch this one as well. The paralysis would help a little bit with catching. There you go. Very good. So much I I I. I know, we're seeing all the cuties. We're seeing all the cuties. We will see the more terrifying Pokemon down the line, I'm sure. But we're still in the early stages, so... Uh, yeah, it will... Uh, we'll see some more fearsome ones soon, I'm sure. <laughs> Although, how can you get more fearsome than Yampa? Yampa is true terror, right? <laughs> That's when we'll need a Pog. Yeah. Yeah, we'll, we'll need more Pogs for the more epic ones. Hopefully we will have a puck by then. <laughs> Alright, Rookie D has got himself a level up. Very cool. I wonder when Rookie D will evolve. We'll see. Minchino, the chinchilla Pokemon. The way it brushes away grime with its tail can be helpful when cleaning, but its focus on spotlessness can make clear, uh, cleaning more of a hassle. Oh, is that Tice's Pog? Wow. <laughs> nice. Pog ties. Wow, that is quite an electric pog that. I like that. Alright. Alright, and one more old Pokemon to catch here. This is Swirlix. Good old Swirlix. String close up pog, yeah. I don't think I'll be going that close. Wait, what? Uh, Alright, so here we go. Da that tongue. I know, right? Any Pokemon that kind of has its tongue out like that is. Awesome! <gasps> Yampa just got tombstoned! Holy crap. Okay. I didn't even see what move it used. No, good boy. It's alright, it'll be alright. Don't worry. Don't worry. Ouch. Something kissy. Ah, right, okay. Now that makes a bit of sense. Dang. Okay, aromatherapy will do nothing because it's not affected by any statuses. I saw a lips. Right. It might be like Sweet Kiss or something. I was looking at chat at the time. <laughs> uh, Alright. Let's catch this bad boy. Uh, let's get ourselves a Pokeball. Sorry. No, don't be sorry. Don't be sorry. It's all good. It's all good. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, okay. Swirlix is apparently a beast. Swirlix, you are a Gen 6. I want to say 6. It might not be six, but I want to say Gen Six Pokemon. Um, so I remember. I think I remember in Gen Six a couple of cakey kind of things came out of uh, that game. Looks cute, but we'll kill you. Oh, absolutely! He just killed our Corgi. Cakey. Yeah, there's a couple of cakey Pokemon back in Gen Six. Gen Six um, had a very French feel about it, and you know how French are with like patisserie and all that. So, yeah. Swirlix, the cotton candy Pokemon. It eats its own weight and sugar every day. If it doesn't get enough sugar, it becomes incredibly grumpy. 
preaching to choir lad. <laughs> Just like me. It you. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Basically me. Alright, okay. Uh, seems like our good friend Exo might have found a Dottler or evolved a Dottler. Very cool. Uh, Alright, let us max revive Yampa. You're worth it, bud. You're worth it. Alright, okay. You caught that dot you caught a dotler? Nice. Alright. So where do we want to go? Do we want to go down? I see a Pokeball up there. Alright, let's stay on level here. Let's stay over here. Very good, man. Congratulations on the on the Dotler. Dotler's pretty cool. Alright, what if we go over here? Oh, a Shed Shell. Cool. An item to be held by a Pokemon. This discarded carapace enables the holder to switch out to uh, switch out of battle without fail. So that's really good if you're going to be going up against strong Pokemon that you kind of want to escape from. Uh, Alright. Let's see what else we got over here. Oh, I know where this is. Is this breeding? The Pokemon Nursery. You found the right place to come to for all your Pokemon egg finding needs. Oh. Right, so in a lot of these Pokemon games, if they've got a breeding system, they'll also give you a free egg. So I'm hoping we get a free egg here. Nice to see a new face around here. This is a Pokemon Nursery. We take care of people's Pokemon here. When people leave two Pokemon with us, they smash and sometimes they'll have eggs. If you're interested in that sort of thing, ask the old lady inside to tell you more. Do you want to leave any Pokemon with me? Nah, you're alright, love. Alright. Making babies. Yeah. Ooh, what are you? Tox Tox. What are you? What's that Pokemon? It's a Toxel. A real Toxel. Old ladies are fonts of sexy info. Seems so. <laughs> I found an egg and it carried and it, and carried it around with me and it hatched into a Toxel. Why don't you raise it? It's a real shocking Pokemon. Oh! Now they're just giving Pokemon to me! Ooh. Say hello to Toxel. Ooh, sweet. Yeah. Toxel, the baby Pokemon. Electric and poison. Very good. It stores po- uh, Well, that makes it times for a week to ground, though. But that's fine. Oh, he's sad. He looks like a sad boy, doesn't he? <laughs> Such a sad baby. It stores poison in an internal poison sack and secretes that poison through its skin. If you touch this Pokemon, a tingly sensation follows. There you go. Um, you know what? You are just what I need. Let us add you to the party, my good friend. Um, I'm going to make the decision that Dotler won't evolve again. So yeah, Dotler can go for now. Dotler's gonna go back to the box and Toxel will stay with us. Tox Tox! There you go. And take these two. They'll help your Pokemon grow if you use them. And we get some experience candies. Extra small. Very good. Well, he'll be very happy now that he's got a trainer like us, right? Eggs are found at Pokemon nurseries. Experience candies are found from Max Raid Battles. And you found yourself a real nice friend today, wouldn't you say? Absolutely. There you go. Let's learn a little more about Toxel then. Where are you, fella? There you are. How you doing, sad boy? So it's an electric poison type. All this talk of candy and eggs makes me want a Cadbury's egg. <laughs> oh, God, I could go for a Cadbury's egg right now. Love those things. <laughs> so, uh, what nature are you? Uh, brave. So that's why your speed is so low. Uh, rattle. Dark ghost and bug type moves scare the Pokemon and boost its speed. So whenever we are up against a Dark Ghost or Bug-type move, um, we get a speed boost. That's pretty interesting. Uh, nuzzle and Acid. Very cool. Oh, it's level 1, though. Ah. It's level 1, but that's fine. God, I could, I could defo go for a Cream Egg. Is it Easter yet? I hope so. <laughs> All right, old lady. Oh, welcome! Is there anything you'd like to know about? Um... Nah, you're alright, actually. Please come again! Nope, I wish. Ugh. Easter, come already. <laughs> okay, we got a trainer there. What's over here? Oh, okay, so that looks like progression. We've got the friggin' Yoohoo boys over there. 
Strange game, just boosted the low level they are. Uh, like they earn much more, even. Alright, sweet. Okay, so that means we'll be. Uh, well, Toxel will gain levels uh, decently well. Very good. Anything over there? No? Okay, very cool. Right, so let's head down here. We've got another Swirlix or two, or three, or five. Ghost. Oh god. Oh god, okay. Alright, heal balls. I want to see what the rare Pokemon is. Oh, it's just another Swirlix. <laughs> so I'm going to imagine that the um, the hidden Pokemon are actually uh, like more rare variations, I guess. Not in this case, unfortunately. But uh, yeah, more rare variations. All right. Oh, that's probably why Sweet Kiss did so well, actually. Yeah, so uh, Fake Tears will lower our special defense, and then it uses a special move, which will do mega damage. So let's see if it uses... Oh, no, Fake Tears again. Very good. Very cool. Come on, Yampus. Get that kill, man. Get that kill. Good boy. Good boy. All right, we're doing it, man. We're doing it. Alright, so Toxel will get... Yeah, look at that boosted experience. So Toxel just leveled up seven times. <laughs> so what kind of Pokemon are you? You're a very slow special attacker. Oh wow, yeah, because he was at only level one, uh, he leveled up like seven times, so that's perfectly fine. Don't mind that at all. Uh, we got a chef, and we've got a Pokemon camp out there. Uh, what else? Anything else? Do full... Swellix. Oh, Sword can't get Lotad line? <gasps> Is Lotad exclusive to Shield? Are you serious? Oh, say it ain't so. Oh no, what? <gasps> oh! Hey, Exo. To uh, coins to Cerebi. Oh, can you trade for it? Yeah, we can trade. Um, hey, Exo, is there anything that you want, dude? Do, do you want anything, man? Like anything at all? Like, I'll. Uh, I, I I got what you need, man. I got what you need. I need that lead tested. <laughs> kidney? Yeah, you can have a kidney. You can have a kidney. I have loads and I just caught Alambra. <sighs> Do you want both? Uh, no, just the loads hand. Just the loads hand. Uh, Do you not mind uh, parting with it? There we go. Get that rookie deal to 14. Very good. Uh, I'll take the loads hand if you don't mind. Are you okay parting with it? Let me know. Before I get friggin' swarmed into a battle here. Oh man, sure. Can we do it now? Can we can we do it now, man? Can we? Can we? Can we? Can we? Can we do it now? <laughs> we really want to really want to look test. <laughs> uh, link trade. Yeah, yeah. I see the Lombra there. I got the Lombra to continue his line and have his Pokedex entry. Nice. Okay. Uh. Uh. Okay. No, that's a bad idea. That's a bad idea. Hold on. I got this. Okay. Uh, yeah. Alright. Um, I think this will work. Alright. Okay. 2850. If you can uh, join the link trade room. 2850. I'm going to get a low <laughs> Alright. Cool. Stay away from me, Stuffle. I might be getting a low tad here. Oh, feels good, man. Feels good. <laughs> I'm very excited for some low tad action. Uh, I said I wasn't going to put any old Pokemon in my team, but you just know I got to have a low tad, right? Oh, XO so nice. Yeah. He's a lovely lad. He's a lovely lad. Just hopefully we're able to get this trade thing going on. Uh, okay. Do I just get dragged into the trade? Um, no.
I does the trade just start? I'm gonna be able for a sec while you guys do that. Yeah, go for it. Go for it. Uh, no worries. I'll miss you though. I'll miss you. All right, we got it. Nice, nice. Um, right. So, uh, I don't. I think you said you didn't mind what you received. So, or is there anything that you want? Let me know if there's anything you want, my good friend. Uh, and if there's nothing you want, then uh, I'll give you a stunky. <laughs> Oh man. Um, anything you want, man. Apart from the Pikachu. Pikachu's mine. <laughs> I earned that Pikachu by playing the other game. Vulpix? You'll take a Vulpix? Alright, sweet. Alright, we'll trade it. I have Growlithe. Oh, do you? Ah, okay, cool. Cool. Alright, I'll take Lotad for now. I have a feeling Vulpix is exclusive. It usually is, right? In first gen it was, so yeah. If a communication error occurs, yada yada, sure. Did that in, in gen 1? Yeah, exactly. Exactly. I can imagine it being uh, uh, an exclusive. I'm getting a low tad. I'm so happy. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, Exo. That Gen 1 music. Oh wait, no, it's got, it's got, it's got funky now. Ah, uh, Lotan looks so derpy. Oh, I love it. Oh, he's such a good boy. Yeah, that remix, right? It starts out so kind of old school and then gets a bit funky. <laughs> Lotad, the water weed Pokemon. It searches about for clean water. If it does not drink water for too long, the leaf on its head wilts. Oh, poor fella. Exo, thank you so much! You're so awesome! I love you, Exo. You are bloody wonderful, you are. Bloody wonderful, good sir. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you! Um, alright, okay. Uh, alright. Uh, hmm. I want these to evolve. Thank you for the Vulpix. Yeah, no problem, bud. No problem. Glad I could oblige. There you go. Glad I could get you something, bruh. Oh-ho! I have found a trainer with gathering berries. Because all chefs are French. <laughs> Stewards. That's my brother's name. Alright, let's friggin' do it, boys. Let's friggin' do it. Alright, enjoy that Vulpix, my good friend. Oh, look, it's a Pokemon that looks like an apple called Applin. I like it. All right, uh, let us tackle. Good old Applin. Is this the Pokemon you had, Exo? You had a Pokemon that looks like that. Oh, dang, you're pretty strong, actually. You're pretty tough. Uh, all right, we'll get Reboot on. Yeah, you got the Applin. Nice. Good old Applin. That's a cool looking Pokemon. I assume it's some kind of like caterpillar with its head stuck in an apple. Gotten from a raid I did with a friend. Ah, nice. How was the raid? We did, um, oh, you, you obviously saw it. We did um, the, the Diglett, the, the, the Dynamax Diglett raid. I boxed all my other raid claims. Ah, fair enough. Oh, is there a Shell Smash? Oh, no, just defense, okay. Have you been going around raiding with your friends then? Like, have you just been doing a load of that? That's really cool if you have. Uh, Alright, very cool. Very cool. Scrobat's got a level. Very good. I did about five. Nice. I'll be doing more on stream for sure. And off stream, actually. I should have given my Pokemon a belly when its HP got low. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Absolutely. Uh, right, okay. Yampus needs to heal like crazy. Welcome back, KMS! Welcome back! Hopefully you are well, my lovely. Hopefully you're bloody well. Alright, let's get those potions in. They're great. Did you get the Lotad? Yeah, it's not on our team yet, though. Not on our team yet, but we got it. Oh! <gasps> I did it. I did it. They are great to collect different Pokemon and get materials. Yeah, for sure. Oh, you found one. Yeah. Exo. Holy crap. Look what they did to Farfetch'd. Holy crap. Okay. Please don't kill. 
Wow, so Farfetch'd is a normal and flying type Pokemon, but in this game... I messed up choosing Corvusquire as my flying. <laughs> oh man, forgot this absolute god is here. Yeah, I might choose this as my flyer as well, actually. Oh man, oh look at it. Oh man, its friggin' stick is like massive as heck. Oh, it's so good. All right, throw that great ball. What? Oh, 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 you're a tough boy. Oh, you tough boy. Oh, oh, dang. The sword onion leak, yeah. Oh, it's so good. Um, all right, let's nuzzle you. Oh my God, he's gonna kill the Ampers, is it? Oh man, he's strong as balls. <laughs> <laughs> he's so strong! Why is he so strong? Dang, Farfetch got good. So yeah, Farfetch, um, that's a big leak. Yeah, yeah, so here's the thing, KMS. Farfetch's leak normally is actually really, really small. It's, uh, yeah, it's usually really, ba uh, really small, but I guess now it's absolutely massive. It, it grew. It grew over the generations, apparently. Wow. There you go. Please catch. I want it. Wow. Oh, we ain't for budging. Oh, he's whack. Oh, my God. Dude. What happened to Farfetch? Um. God. Such a breeding in the UK. I know, right? <laughs> we got strong leaks in the UK. Oh wow, bird watchers beware. Ow! He just blasted Reboot! I mean, he's level 20. Yeah, he is a tough boy, that's for sure. Um. Alright, let's go get him, Scrover. We're getting to the B team now. Uh. Uh. Okay. Wish me luck! <laughs> Oh, he's so strong. Good luck. I'm gonna need a lot of luck. Oh! Poor Scrover. I'm gonna wipe. Holy crap. All right, Tootle, let's do it. Dude, Farfetch'd is a monster. Game Freak were like, yeah, yeah, we, we, got, we got the terror. And his name is Farfetch'd. Wow. Oh, man. Everything bows down to Farfetch'd, man. The mighty Farfetch'd. The wiper of teams. It's like I'm trying to catch a legendary. I'm catching a legendary right now, pretty much. Uh... Uh, Premier Ball? Why not? Yeah, this is nuts. I know, right? He's just friggin' smashing us hard. He is not for turning. Holy crap. Wallop! Oh, I'm so disappointed right now. Oh, I want him. I want him so bad. Uh, oh, as if Toxels. These two aren't gonna do anything. Oh my god. Oh, look at Toxel. <laughs> um, I just gotta hope. I just gotta hope. Oh, is it is it a diaper? Yeah, he kind of does, isn't he? Oh man. Oh man. I put so many resources into this. Do I have to commit here? All right, I have revives. Gosh, yeah, we are being absolutely destroyed here. All right, um... Okay, we got four revives. Let's get, uh, Yampa back into the mix, I guess. Brutal swing is such a strong move. Although saying that, Ricky D got it. 
Holy crap, okay. Uh, yeah, get in the bowl, you bugger. Come on, succumb to my mightiness. God damn it. <laughs> oh, oh, look at that badass leer as well. Oh man, far-fetched is no joke, bruh. <laughs> I want it. God damn it. Alright, I'm kind of hoping it's run out of moves. If it's run out... It, I mean, I don't think it has, but I'm kind of hoping it has. What a boss? I know, right? I'm being dapped all over right now. One. Two. Ah. Oh, no. No, it found a brutal swing. It found a brutal swing. Oh, my God. Okay. All right, uh, I think I'm okay wiping against this guy. Yampa, you got one shot, lad. You got one shot, fella. Good luck. All right, Leer is non-damaging. That's good. All right, Nuzzle for Paralyze. <gasps> oh, it almost killed it. All right, this is it. This is it. It's now or never. It makes you feel better. I went through what you just went through four times for Corvus Quiet. Really? Oh, wow. Unlucky, dude. Unlucky. This is it. Paralyzed. Down on one health. This has to be it. Good luck, Dan. Ah, uh, what? Oh. I've never been so thoroughly robbed by a bird before! I know! Oh, come on, get in the bowl, far effects. I don't think I have either. Wow. Oh, paralyzed. Okay, we'll get another chance. What are my feelings mostly? <laughs> come on! Please! One. Only stole a couple hundred quid. I have a, I have a feeling. Wait, are you, are you talking about a, a female now, or are you talking about a, a bed that actually steals money? Oh gosh. Oh wait, oh wait, oh we panic and drop money. Right. Sorry, I thought you were telling telling me about some kind of experience where you, where you kind of, I don't know, some girl took money from you. <laughs> I didn't realize we dropped money when we failed in a wild battle. I'm such an idiot. I understand now. I lost 300, dude. Holy crap. Table flips indeed. KMS, that, that was weird. We just got walloped. God damn it. You scurry back to the Pokemon Center, protecting your exhausted Pokemon from any, from any harm. That was weird, right? We just got friggin' tombstoned. How is it so strong? Oh, I don't know. I, g I guess Galar friggin' Farfetched is just terrifying. Holy crap, dude. Uh, oh, more items? Sure. Holy crap, okay. Let's, bet, let's get 21 Great Balls. And, uh, let's get like four super potions. Oh. All right. I mean, you bet your ass I'm going back for round two. <laughs> we just got what? Oh, wait. Change the, change the Pokemon team. Uh, okay. So, um, well, I want you, Lotad. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, I'm gonna put Rookie D away. Okay. I know, it seems weird, but you know what I'm like for low tats, guys. <laughs> you know what I'm like for Lenny Colos. Alright. Should we try again? Hopefully, we can find another far fetched, but my god. That was absolutely terrifying. 
Holy crap. We just friggin' wiped against a far-fetched. Words I never thought I'd ever say, ever. Alright. Where are you, you bugger? I want it. We do? Yeah. Yeah, we do. We like our, we like our low tads. We love our Liddy Colos. Oh, we can... Oh! Alright, round two! Round two has been activated! <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're going down, fella. You're going down. Level 19, slightly better. Alright. Oh. Get that boy. Yeah, you're mine, bud. Alright. And we got the paralysis early on the spark. Very good. Alright, you ain't going anywhere, fella. You ain't going anywhere. Fury Cutter. That's... Uh, Absolutely fine. All right, slightly higher health, but a very much, very much a better ball. So let's see if the great balls will help us. Oh. Wow. All right. All right. Fine. <laughs> it's just. Oh. Oh man. Oh man. It is a monster! It is an absolute monster! We need like a level 5 one. Yeah! He like. Oh, I killed it. Oh no! God damn it. Desirable flying type in this game are monsters. They are! They're so crazy strong! Lotad just got like a gajillion experience! <laughs> wow. Oops, yeah, we were slightly too strong there. Oh, Lotus had lens water gun. So good. Missed. What does that do again? Nothing, right? Uh, the user clicks itself and adds in a white mist. Uh, no, we don't want that. We don't want that. Well, the team will be stronger for the next one. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Ooh, Mega Drain. Absolutely. Uh, the one at the very start. Uh, a joke to catch. And then it goes to Dark Souls 3 <laughs> difficulty for this one. Yeah, we just got friggin' smashed, didn't we? Dark Souls smashed. Holy crap. Wow. That's terrifying. I want it. I want it so badly. Holy polar. Alright, Yampers, you're back in, bud. Uh... Alright, I think we're gonna spend some time on this. I want it, dudes. I want it. I want it. I want it so bad. Um, oh god. Uh, okay. So the 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 common enough. They are rarer than these lot, but they're common enough to actually show. Here we go. All right, round three. Ring a ding ding! It's round three. Oh my god. All right, Yampers, remember your Dark Souls rolls. <laughs> All right, so this is a level 20, fella. Oh, God. It knows some reasonably dope moves as well. All right, we absolutely have to paralyze it. Good luck. Thanks. I think I'm going to need it. Oh, I'm so going to need it. I'm so glad I nuzzled here. Oh, man. Alright, okay. Now we gotta weaken it. Spark again. Alright. Alright, brutal swing will kill Yampas off. Poor Yampas. <laughs> Yampas is our best chance of setting him up, but man, Yampas takes an absolute pounding from this fella. Uh, Alright, reboot, let's go. Best boy. He's the best boy, man. He's giving everything for us. God love him. He's going to get such a good belly rub. And then Reboot just kills him. And that's Electric versus Flying. I know. I know, right? Isn't that nuts? I feel like I'm power leveling here. Isn't that nuts? That's the sacrificial Corgi. Yeah. <gasps> oh, Lotan's evolving, though! <laughs> Gah! We may have only just got our little baby boy Lotan, but behold, current gen Lombra. Woo! 
Yeah! Look at that lovely face. <laughs> Pog for the Lombras. Woo! Thank you for the gift of the low tad. I appreciate it, Exo. <laughs> Lombreth, the jolly Pokemon. It is nocturnal and becomes active at nightfall. It feeds on aquatic mosses that grow in the riverbed. Good boy. Such a good boy. Alright. Okay. Alright. <sighs> want that bird. I want that bird. I want it. I want that bird. It's happening. It's happening. Uh, right, where are you? Oh, a Drifloon! Nice, okay. So there's Drifloons around here as well. Uh, alright. I want that Farfetch'd. I want it so badly. Uh, Minchino, Swirlix, Stuffle. The Swirlix is after me. Oh, Wobbuffet? What is Wobbuffet doing here? Alright. Okay. Uh, slight detour. Found, kind of found myself a Wobbuffet. That's fine. Uh, say hello to Wobbuffet. Uh, Wobbuffet's a very strange Pokemon. It's a psychic type that can't really attack. It, it doesn't really have an offensive move. What it tends to do is it uses a move called Counter or... Um, what's the other one called? Uh, I can't remember the other one. Mirror Guard. Not Mirror. Mirror something? I can't remember what it's called. But basically, um, if I use a physical attack and it uses counter, I will take double damage back. Nice. Moveset is what's offensive to look at. Nice. <laughs> it, it, it is pretty disgusting for sure. But basically, yeah, it's, a, it's effectively a punching bag. If it uses counter, I'm dead. No, okay. We're good. We're good. All right. I want it. I want it. Good old Wobbuffet. All right, no counter. Mirror Coat, that's the one. So Mirror Coat is a counter for special. So if I use a special attack and use uh, Mirror Coat, it will do double damage back to me. All right, that's just great ball. Counter and Mirror Coat, yeah, yeah, yeah. Power bonds mean look, yeah. Oh god, it's a, it's a, it's a pretty painful Pokemon. Oh yeah, here we go, Destiny Bond. So if I now kill it. Yampers will also die. That's how Destiny Bond works. <laughs> yeah, Destiny Bond. God damn it. Yikes. Yeah, it's uh it's pretty much a last resort kind of move. But yeah, if I if I knock it out, it will knock Yampers out too. To Wow. I don't know what's happened, but catching Pokemon has suddenly become the hardest thing in the universe. We might have to leave these guys. Wow. I mean, yeah, we're going to have to leave these guys, I think. I mean, it's good that we, um, it's good that we've got them on the Pokedex. Oh. Yeah! We got around with that. All right, okay, good. <laughs> Holy crap. That was so crazy. Oh man. Okay. Woo! We caught a Pokemon. Look at Wabafet. Wabafet! The patient Pokemon. It hates light and shock. If attacked, it inflates its body to pump up its Counter Strike. So yeah, imagine. Why do they hate our balls all of a sudden? I know, right? They don't like our balls at all. Feels bad, man. <laughs> yeah, so just imagine, like, um, punching, like, a punching bag, and then it swings back into you and hits you. That's Wobbuffet, basically. Like, he'll take the punch, and then he'll smack you around again um, with your own uh, force. So, yeah, there you go. There's Wobbuffet. All right, I said I was going to leave it, but catching Wobbuffet has filled me with determination. Yay. Good old Undertale. All right, let's see. See if we can find something around here. Hey, Staffel, how you doing, bud? There's another Wobbuffet. Okay, so Wobbuffets are apparently a bit more common around here. 
drinks. There you go. Good, good. <laughs> Hopefully you're excited for Undertale tomorrow. I'm excited for Undertale tomorrow. Been fun playing so much of this, though. I'm glad I was able to get so much playtime out of this uh, in the first two days. Super hyped. Yay! Cool, cool. Ah, here we go. All right. Round four. All right. We're hoping it's level 19. No, nope, it's a 20. All right. Nuzzle. Fun games all the time. Yeah. Big fan of the old fun games. Oh, okay. All right. Okay, so Nuzzle for the Paralysis. And now we use Spark for the damage. That's because you're a fun guy. Oh, you're too kind. You're too kind. <laughs> thank you, thank you. <laughs> I'm a fun guy, like a mushroom. <laughs> Cutie stream a mushroom, right? All right, brutal swing. Ow. Okay. This has to be it. This absolutely has to be it. All right, one more. One more. Yampers, one more, bud. Please don't crit. All right, this has to be it. This has to be it. This has to be it right here. I have used legendary catching strats here. This has to be it. Come on. This is it. Come on. <laughs> oh, Yampas, you poor thing. All right. There goes Yamps again. Oh, man. I hope there's no, like, permanent record for, like, how many times your Pokemon have fainted. Because Yampas is going to have a hyper-inflated one, thanks to this friggin' fella. All right. No, yeah, poor guy. Come on, come on. You go, go on a. I'm gonna go on a list. Yeah, exactly. No. I'm gonna go on a list for letting birds bully my my corgi. Oh. We were so close. Oh god. I'm surprised Farfetch hasn't just wandered over to me and killed me yet. <laughs> Alright. One. Oh, I'm so sad. I'm so sad. I could not be more sad. Just popped out of the screen into your room. Yeah, just uh, yeah. Well, I I actually I actually met my my trainer, but yeah. I mean, he's probably powerful enough to break through the bonds of this video game and into the realms of reality. I know you did. Oh, okay, good. Just making sure. <laughs> oh man, Farfetch gonna kill you. Farfetch gonna kill. You. Oh man. Oh. oh man, Farfetch, please. There's like, there's nothing I can do. There's nothing more I can do. I can maybe do a tiny bit more damage, but at the in the grand scheme of things, it's it's nothing. If you get him on that low health, he should stay in the damn ball. Yeah, he should. He absolutely should. But he cares not for the the rules of of real life. He is he is the dominator. He is the king of kings. Even though it's a she right now. <laughs> All right, Truthful, tank this one for me, bud. Here we go. He killed the baby. He killed the baby as well. He's unstoppable. One. Ah, God damn it. Ow, Tootle tanks it. What a monster, right? Yeah. I've not seen anything like this. Wow. I've not seen anything like this. 
like, holy moly. I need my support trainer from Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu so I can throw two balls. <gasps> no! <laughs> Stop playing with my emotions, Farfetch'd. That would be nice. Wouldn't that be a nice addition? That'd be so good. Oh, I'm so disappointed. I'm so disappointed. How? I have no idea. Absolutely no idea. Farfetch'd is a beast. For anyone who didn't know, Farfetch'd is now amazing. Holy crap. He's just not that bothered. He's just not ba that bothered. He'll, he'll kill anything. He'll kill his own kind. What a badass, eh? It's just not happening. <laughs> it's just not happening! Oh, man. He's not having any of your balls. I know, right? I've given him pretty much every kind of ball I could, I could give him. One. Oh. Oh, it's not happening. It's not happening. Damn it. God damn it. Am I willing to give you Lombra? I don't want to give you Lombra. At the same time, I want one more go. Lombra, just kill it. If, if this misses and I'm still alive, sure. One, two, three. No! All right, I gotta keep going. <laughs> Gotta keep going. I'm in the realm of gambler right now. Oh my god. Okay. Uh, heal ball. Why not? Okay. A heal ball. When you catch the Pokemon, it will automatically heal if caught. Fury Cutter will kill Lombra. Wow. Wow. Far fetched, ladies and gentlemen. Not taking you to Vegas. I know, right? Don't, no, don't take me to Vegas. Holy crap. <laughs> How strong is Farfetch'd? Holy crap. Oh my god. Farfetch'd is so god darn strong. That's incredible. That's so, so incredible. All right, Farfetch'd, you win, bud. I understand why it won't stay in the ball when it's on such low health. Yeah, yeah, it, it's not a guaranteed chance, really. Like, the way the catching formula works is that it takes things like health and status into account, but the number it produces at the end isn't always 100%, sadly. It should be, absolutely. But yeah, that warrior, man, that friggin' warrior. All right, let's get some story. <laughs> Oi, just hand over that bike already. We need it to cross this long bridge. We're gonna use that bike to chase around gym challenges. It'll be a scream. How barbaric. Uh, it wouldn't work anyway. You don't even have a Rotom with you. Hey, young gym challenger, they're trying to steal me bike. Please, if you could give them a good freshen, I'd be in your debt. All right, as long as you don't have Farfetch, we'll be fine. We tried so many times. I know, I know, right? Heartbreaking, absolutely heartbreaking. <laughs> Oi, we're not trying to steal the bike, only borrow it. We're gonna use it to chase after gym challengers and make them all tired. But I'm thinking you deserve a special shout out. I'm gonna crush you in a battle. All right. I mean, we can kill one. Yeah, we could just about kill one for sure. But man, to catch one, I don't, I don't even know, man. I'm gutted. I don't know what to say. 
I honestly don't know what to say. I wanted that so badly as well. <laughs> I wanted it so badly. Oh man. Look at the Zigzagoon. That was so RNG. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, uh, it's fine. It's fine. We'll get one. We'll get one. Like, as we grow in level, um, we'll get, like, better balls. Uh, we'll get Ultra Balls eventually. So, yeah, we'll be fine. Oh, look who got themselves a Feeble. It wasn't you. Oh, thank you for saying that. I appreciate that. We did everything we could. There you go. We got a Feeble, though. So we know Feeble's a Dark-type Pokemon, because uh, we've had one ourselves. Gotta go, I'll catch up the rest later. I won't be streaming for too much longer, Exo, so don't worry, man. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching, bro. Thanks for the load, Tad. Have a good night. Uh, have a good day, sorry. I'll see you next time, fella. Farewell, my good friend. Farewell. There you go. He's a good lad, that Exo. He's a good lad. Uh, alright. Alright, and... Boop. Take that, people. Oh, man. I feel so beaten. I feel so beaten and bruised after that. Oh, dang. Uh, oh, wow. Okay, so Scrovert wants to learn Body Slam. Oh, man. That was rough. I know, right? That, that, was, that was heartbreaking. Like, legitimately heartbreaking. <laughs> Thank you for the hugs. Appreciate it. <laughs> We're Team Meow. We get up in the faces of trainers. Yeah, sure, fella. Oh, no evolution. Okay. Gah! You crushed my attempt to crush you. Why, you? I want that bike. Don't get in my way. So Team Yell appear to be bullies. Hooligans and bullies. God damn it. All right, so we got Sabli. Gen 3 Pokemon Dark and Ghost type has no weakness. Well, no, actually, no. Fairy types now. Uh, but it used to have no weakness. Oh, hello. There you go. Okay, and a couple of sparks should still do it. It may not have a weakness or much of one, but we should be able to beat it up. Unless it uses Disable, of course. Disable will stop us from using the last move that we use, which is Spark. So that's really annoying. Guess I'll have to nuzzle it to death. You can do it. Oh, God, I'm going to try my best. I think we'll be fine. I think we can always go to Reboot. I think that's exactly what we're going to do. Uh, let's go to Reboot. Uh, okay. Yeah, let's switch to, switch to Reboot here. And, uh, let Reboot clean up. Go get him, Reboot. Go get him. So, Astonish is supposed to be quite a weak uh, ghost-type move. So, uh, it's doing quite a lot of work. Being nuzzled to death by a Yampa sounds like a nice way to go. <laughs> yeah, it may paralyze you a little bit, but that's fine. That's all good. <laughs> All right, there we go. Reboot, Lombra, and Toxel all got levels. Very good. Reboot wants to learn Agility. Um, could be useful, actually. Oh, Reboot. No, no, not for Reboot. I meant Toxel. Uh, Lombra grew to level 17. Toxel grew to 16. Very good. I was too distracted by that bike. Otherwise, there's no way I'd lose to a yellow belly like you. Wow, rude. He just called me a yellow belly. So rude. You're too strong. If you stay in the gym challenge, you're going to cause problems for our lady. You haven't seen the last of us. We're going to make sure you stay out of my lady's way. Because Team Yell! Ah, uh, that actually makes sense. <laughs> I didn't realize that. I'm so sleepy. <laughs> my words, you're quite the trainer. And I see you have a Pokedex too. That means you have a Rotom with you. Fantastic. I think I'll give you the spite to you then. Better you have it than Team Yell. Uh, now you know that Rotom loves motors very, very much, right? Enough to jump right into the machine that have motors? So that got me thinking. If I attach a motor to a bicycle, then maybe I could get a Rotom to pop into that as well. Okay. Come now, give it a shot. Enjoy cycling together with Rotom to the forest. Chop, chop, come on now. You and Rotom ride the bicycle together. We're going to ride a bicycle, KMS. There we go. I'll read the manual. Press the plus or minus button to ride your bike. We've wrote them. Let's go cycling. Oh, oh look, at, look at what I'm wearing. I want to ride my bicycle. I want to ride my bike. 
Oh, loose. We look dope? Yeah, we do. Ooh, a resist feather. I don't know what that does. Very cool. How you doing, love? What is the problem with those Team Yell goons? I can understand wanting to cheer someone on, but they cause so much trouble in the process. I was just singing that song in my head, yeah? <laughs> nice. Sing along with me. <laughs> I'll need a decent way for fans to behave. Bicycle! Bicycle! I want to ride my bicycle! I want to ride my bike! Ah, uh, good, right? Oh, uh, what is that? Oh, is that Motorstoke? That big building you see in the distance is Hammerlock Stadium. You're going to battle there too. Oh, very cool. Bicycle. Oh, there we go. There you are, Dan. Beautiful singing, KMS, by the way. Very good. I'm warning you, though. Any closer to that than that, we're going to have to have a battle, you and me. All right. Well, you know what? I think we're going to save that for next time. <laughs> I think we're gonna save that for next time. Didn't quite make uh, four hours, but I am friggin' wrecked right now. I am friggin' wrecked. <sighs> ah, we did it! We did it! Ooh, you got a ton done. Such a good stream. Oh, glad you enjoyed it. Glad you enjoyed it. Appreciate you watching. Yeah, no problem. No problem. Mm. All right, let's uh, let's end it properly, shall we? Give me a second. There we go. So yeah, loved it. Cool. Glad you liked it. Woo! So yeah, there you go. The first seven and a half hours of Pokemon Sword. We will be playing more of this next week, which is awesome. Tomorrow, though, we'll be playing Undertale, and then uh, hopefully we'll finish that. We finish Undertale, then we can get back to The Witcher next week. So, super, super dope. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching, guys. Appreciate it. Have a good night, and I'll see you all next time. Farewell, everybody. Farewell.